Good evening, morning, afternoon. I have once again been hellishly wrought through the night by small animals, ruining my sleep. They keep pooping in the middle of the night, and they go pee-pee in the middle of the night. Uh, do you have the stream at half speed? No, I'm just clocked in at half speed. Barry, thank you very much for the super chat. Hi, Gail's mom, if you're watching. I'm sure glad Pipsqueaks have been so kind and respectful to your son at all times. Ha! Ha ha! Oh god, thanks for reminding me. Uh, thank you for the super chat, Barry. And from Nai, curse my office times. I hope you riz up that reaper well. To all the Pipsqueaks, have fun! Thank you, Nai, for the super chat. Now, I hope you guys have fun, too. I hope that today is going to be... A gale gallon of absolute hilarious laughter and stuff. The single dad lifestyle. These puppies. I swear, puppies are absolutely hellish to take care of. No mustache today? No, I respect you guys enough to not put on the mustache when I'm rising up uh, grimy. <laughs> Gorilla sleeping Minecraft? No, today's dedicated date with death day what a puppo do oh they're just bad <laughs> they're just bad at messing themselves in the house uh mustache is fun uh but mustache makes me look like like i belong in the adams family i look like i'm in a different franchise entirely whenever i put the mustache on Oof. I'm trying to get my camera right Oh, my eyes are so dry, by the way. My eyes, um... We have the, um... I have the heater on in the cabin. And... So that I don't freeze my ass off at night. Because my feet get really cold. And I usually need just, like, one blanket with the heater. And it's pretty comfy. Cozy. But, like, the heater... I need, like, a humidifier or something. Because... I can barely keep my eyes open, dude. It's like I was just staring into the sun... And all of the, all of my eyeball juices are just gone from me. They've, dese they've disintegrated from this world. Take my eye patch off. Take my eye patch off so I can hydrate my eyes. I'm gonna pour some water into them. Ugh. Gales, hi guys. That's right, guys. My eyes hurt not because of the heater. Um, when I said heater, actually, guys, what I meant was, haha, I was getting heated, haha, and by heated, I was, <laughs> no, I was not doing drugs. No, I was not doing drugs. I need, like, eye drops or something. No more toes for cats and get a peg leg. You know what? Having two peg legs in the middle of the night when I'm trying to sleep actually would go so hard, unbelievably hard. At least my toes wouldn't get freezing. And you know what's funny? Is that little pup, he sleeps at the foot of my bed, like literally on my feet. And I hate it. It's so uncomfortable, but I hate to move him because he's so damn cute. But even despite that, he's so small, he doesn't generate any heat. So my feet remain cold. So he's sitting there with my clammy toes. My clammy toes are basically the cool side of his bed or the cool side of his pillow for him. He's like, oh. This is nice. It's not too hot in here anymore. I've got an ice pack here for my for my freaking toes. Freaking sucks, man. And I'm uncomfortable, but he's comfortable. But my toes aren't getting warmer because of him, so it's like I'm doubly uncomfortable. How could one man be so unlucky? Put on socks. You know, even though I've, I've done that before, I've tried putting on socks. I, I, the, the moment of silence was um for comedic effect. I put on socks before, and for some reason, my feet just don't generate any heat. I think I need to amputate my feet. I think I do need two peg legs. I think there's not enough blood circulation going on down there, so I think it's about time we just amputate. Get rid of them. Cut the, cut the source off at the, uh, at the very top of it. Fuzzy socks would help. I need socks that aren't fuzzy. Because I'm afraid of static shocks. Like, I genuinely... I get, like, gut-wrenchingly anxious uh, whenever I anticipate static shocks. Huh. 
You put your socks in your on your heater? <sighs> I don't, well, I guess I do have a radiator, but you know what? That's not a bad idea. That's actually not a bad idea. I might try that. I might just put some socks over my radiator for like a minute or two, heat them up, and then turn off the radiator so it doesn't get too hot. That's a good idea. Oh, I tried slipper socks, grippy socks. I have socks that are good for it. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Hi. Hi, buddy. <laughs> you can't do it with socks. It's too funky of a feeling. And I'm totally okay with it. I mean, socks, they feel normal to me whenever I wear them. They don't feel like I'm wearing anything extra on my feet, thankfully. It's nothing. <sighs> it's nothing too much. You can't breathe if you wear socks. Are you a fish? Or like... Are you like a, um, a frog? Don't frogs breathe through their skin or something like that? Are you a frog? Are you actually secretly a frog person? And you breathe through your feet? But that's insane. Ugh. In your old office, you got shocked multiple times a day. Freaking hate going to work during the winter and knowing that every single door that you try to open you know your fingers are going to get the the tremendous power of built up static if you have an air blower dryer i don't have an air blow dryer do i look like i need to blow dry my hair i let that i let that stuff air dry i brush it then it air dries that's the process my hair care maintenance is extremely small there's a not it's not a very long list i i shower i get out of the shower i pat my hair down and then after that done my hair is done during the day you're fine when you wear them with shoes and stuff but wearing them without shoes you, you can't because you feel like your feet are being squished it's weird i get that it's like somebody's like like cr like try to crush your feet like a can or something like that right i don't know that's strange. That's so strange. The good thing is when you know you get shocked, just hold a tiny piece of metal tight and touch it with the first, with the thing first. Oh, to like diffuse the static. Now that's some level of science, science wizardry that I hadn't considered yet. I just kind of big balled it and toughed it up and Stuck my hand on it, got shocked every time. You know what's worse than getting your hand shocked is um, when you get a static shock and it hits your fingernail before it hits like the meat of your hand. That, my friends, is what the, uh, the underground agencies of the world should be studying on how to torture somebody is shocking somebody's fingernails. Not even the fingertips, the fingernails. That's torture baby thank you thank you i'll take my nobel my anti-nobel prize uh after stream thank you Irie, thank you for the super chat cut you back to work can't believe they called you back so soon what the hell or what woofa is a pain woofa what the hell's woofa happy stream and good luck with the rising of grimmy thank you i hope i get to uh see what our q boy is made of today Ugh. oh boy oh boy new language Barry, my mom says thank you for the kind words. <laughs> Stop trying to riz up my mom, please. Guys, chill. Chill, chill, chill. Okay, there we go. All right. I'm going to go ahead and jump into the wild world. Mom, please stop watching this stream. Of all the streams, please don't watch this one. Thank you in advance, please. This is not made with parental advice. This this needs a parental advisory for the opposite reason. I need my parents out of here. I'm going to be saying some unsavory things that you do not want to hear your son say. Oh my god, so loud. I raise your mom's. It's your right to raise your mo my mom back. What the hell? That's not that's not true. That's not true at all. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's, shut up. <laughs> Screw you. I hate you. Uh. Mm. 
Mom, get out of my room. I'm playing video games. I'm playing more than video games. I'm playing with a man's heart. Mom, I'm going to become extremely gay on this stream. You're not prepared for that. I was going to ask if you if you're prepared for that. You're not prepared for that. You don't you don't have what it takes to sit with the uh, with me when we play a date with death. I assure you. Like look at these look at these little twinks. Look at these little twinks. You know what? I'm going to just draw. No, I'm going to play word lit until my mom leaves, okay? Here we go. Uh, Boxley, thank you for the super chat. Mama Galleon, my new Oshi. What? How could you say that? My mom says, I always knew you were. Gay, that is. They're starting to... They're starting to encroach on my stream a little bit too much. Don't you guys think? They're starting to hog the show. All right. This one goes out to my mom. This word is, um, Trump. That, wait, no, no. Wait, that, that could be misinterpreted. It's not for any reason other than just like a trumpet. I was thinking of a trumpet, guys. Lapos, hello. Thank you for the super chat. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Gail. Hi, chat. I'm just popping in to wish y'all a happy time gaming because I'm going to the rodeo. Have fun, guys. Oh, wait, a real rodeo? Wait, that's awesome. Are you going to be the Rodeoer? Barry, thank you for the super chat. Good luck, Grimmy. Stay safe. Please have Cap home by a respectable hour before his 4 a.m. bedtime. God, I wish I got to sleep by 4, 4 a.m. last night. That would have been sick. All right. Um, uh, Let's see. Teams. Oh, my God. I'm so good, except every single letter is in the wrong spot. Off to work. Take care. Oh, my gosh. Meats. Uh, Meats. Steam. Steam? Nope, not steam. It's um so, what the hell could this be? <laughs> Living in the void. Thank you for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Sorry, I should have gotten straight to, to talking to Grimmy, shouldn't I have? This is so disrespectful, but I'm almost done. I promise. What could this word be? S uh, um, um, uh, uh, smite? No, because the E's in the center. Um, the T and the M are in the wrong places. Smile? No, because there's a T in there. Smelt! Oh, that's a good word. It's smelt. You guys are smart. Thank you. All right, let's, let's go talk to. You. Gwyn, Gwyn me. <laughs> no, wait, I can't read. <laughs> oh, no. Mortal, do not call upon me this day. Adhere to my words, else a curse shall befall you. What? What is blood talking about? Oh, I'm egg. Oh. And my status is, can you fuck off? Wait, let me change that. I forgot how to change it. My username is today is um. Oof! I almost spilled my water. My name is Boy Biscuit, and I'm the deer. That fits, right? I think Boy Biscuit's a good name. Hello? Message was not sent. What the hell? I actually thought I thought in real life my messages were not going through and I was trying to I was about to start doing tech uh, troubleshooting some tech troubleshooting boy biscuit yeah I think it fits pretty well um Steve nothing really matters what I say right here your app is broken there's a meaning behind boy biscuit I'm sure of it oh, warning this is new. Error. System malfunction. Force restart. On my PC? The screen of your computer goes dark. No matter how many times you press the on button, it won't turn back on. He literally reaped my computer! Frustrated, you contemplate once again, throwing your laptop out of the window, then decide against it. It does sound kind of bottom. For this stream only, I'll accept bottom comments. 
Because I'm definitely going for that angle, let meow. Who could afford a new laptop in this day and age? That's what I'm saying! I want to buy a laptop myself for, uh, for FSP work. There's no way I can do that anytime soon. You're waiting, you're waiting there like this for 25 minutes when a ding from your computer gets your attention. Slowly, it boots back up, but you're not greeted by your desktop. Instead, you see a call already connected. Why are you incapable of listening? Nor following a single simple instruction. And in the, the flavor text, oh, I gotta move over. <laughs> There we go. Everything's in its right place again. Green Reaper says, I swear you don't listen purposefully. I'm greeted by my death top instead of my laptop. Hello, my death top. Er, well, yes. Erm, um, well, actually, yes. Why is your camera off? And what did you do to my computer? It is none of your business. Go to the top left corner? I don't wanna... Is it not? Green Pepper says, You are not meant to admit it. What am I supposed to do with you? <laughs> I, s I very clearly said for you not to call upon me. I bet he was like in the middle of a reaping job, wasn't he? He was in the middle of a reaping job and he has this app on his phone. So I kept giving away his position every time I rang him. Every time I DM'd him, he would get a little boop or something like that and he would... He was getting pissed off or something, I bet. Is the music from the game? Yeah, it sure is. Is it too loud? Is it too loud? The music? I can turn it down. Let's turn the game down a little bit more. Nah, it's fine. Okay. Cool, then I'll keep it the way it is. Well... Technically, I didn't. It's low. I might even say. Oh, wow. Let's turn up just a smidgen then. Like right there. I only messaged you. And they didn't even send. Finally decided to block me. Oh, woohoo. Ha. No, wait, wait, that's him. Ha. You cannot escape me that easily. I obviously meant do not disturb me. Do not call me. Do not message me. Yet you could not seem to understand something so simple. So I disabled the functions. Even that didn't deter you. Okay, but like, why? Water. Ugh. Does this have something to do with your camera being off? I, I want to know, too. Why is your camera off? I... Are you okay? It is nothing to worry about. You can tell me if there's a problem. We're super close now, Grimmy. We're like BFFs, conjoined by the... by the belly button, practically. Boopy. Boopy, boopy. What makes you think there's a problem? Maybe I simply wanted a day of peace and quiet. Two things you're notoriously bad at. You say that, and yet, you've called me anyway. So it makes me think something happened. It seems your skill of deduction are adequate, at least. So? What's wrong? I do not wish to discuss the matter. Somehow I miss your face, you know. Man, it's so clingy sounding. Will you turn your camera on? You know, fine. I'll be clingy. How about turning your camera on? Dot, dot, dot. Grim? No, I would prefer not to. It isn't a good idea at the present moment. This dude's getting showered right now, isn't he? This guy's in the shower. He's getting clean for me because he doesn't want to. He doesn't want to stink on our date. Our date with death. What is that supposed to mean? Are you hurt? I suppose you could say that. Why would I? Why would he call you while showering? 
I know plenty of friends of mine that have called me while they're showering. They've got no chill. Nothing will stop them. Oh, wait, puppy, your diaper is coming off. <laughs> One second. Puppy. There you go. Stupid. <laughs> Stupid diaper. All right. Wait, what did he say? I forgot. He said something about um. He actually got hurt or something like that. Really? Grim. Stop yelling. My mind just needs to stabilize itself, so to speak. Your mind? Yes. Is there something wrong with your hearing today? Or perhaps there's a kit. <laughs> perhaps there's a parrot in the call with us. No, 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 uh, 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 no. It's just me and you, Grimmy. No, no one's listening. Babe, get the hell out of here. Guys, I'm kind of scared. Puppy was eating his ass, like nibbling at it. I'm <laughs> like, what's he doing? Are you sure you're okay? How does he know about Pip? I simply need to replenish my energy. You wouldn't understand. That I can understand. You should eat something. Maybe you should have a relaxing bath. Uh, let's out let's out him listen if if he replies to this with um i'm already clean we know he's showering right now as nice as that sounds it won't be enough i just need to rebalance maybe the phone is in one of those tourist phone bags that keeps them from getting wet yeah exactly i know people that like literally put their phone in like a plastic bag so they can take it into the uh bath or the shower so they don't accidentally get it wet Puppy, you're taking stuff out of the room you shouldn't be. Ugh. I'm never gonna stop being a dad. Am I? I just need some time. Which is why I told you to leave me alone today. To rebalance? Yes. My soul has been spent too heavily today. What does that even mean? I want to just listen to Grimmy talk all day. I don't want my character to talk. Suddenly, I want to, I want to like, I want to just neglect every single choice that I have. I want all of my choices to just not exist. I want to just listen to Grimmy talk all day. I want to, I want to be railroaded by Grimmy. What does that even mean? Let us resume via text. Um, okay. What the flick? Why'd this guy hang up on me? I didn't even get to say I love you. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Oh, <gasps> I know about the stream. This will work better. You are simply too bright. Too bright? My boy biscuits? Like sunlight. Blindingly so. I can't decide if you mean that as a compliment or an insult. Honestly, how can someone's aura be so intense and yet be so not? I am unsure. What are you talking about? What blah? What are you talking about? You are an enigma to me. You say a lot of crazy things, but you're being extra strange today. Too many fourth wall breaks. It's making you concerned. First, it was Pip, and now um. Wait, what else? What, me being bright? I'm not that smart. What do you mean by aura? You wouldn't understand. After all, your eyes cannot see what mine see. Oh, the question mark, question mark, question mark. True, true, true. 
Your aura, your soul is like a mirage. Uh, right, yeah. It's beyond odd. Most living creatures have an aura of solid color. Most? Most, yes. Some with a stronger connection to the beyond may have an aura with multiple colors. But the coloring is still solid, always. Ah, uh, yes, I... Haha! <laughs> I'm right there with you, Grimmy. All this... I, I'm picking it up, dude. I'm picking it straight up. Is Grimm in my walls? I hope not. My vibes are just too based. My drip too dank. You simply cannot comprehend me, Grimmy. I am beyond your immortal comprehension. I still don't understand. Oh my god, Final Fantasy XIV reference? With the premium penile enhancements? Let me click on that. What kind of ad is this? It's for Moonflower. If you guys want big peepee, -pee, you know what to play. Ah. I still don't understand. Do you have an eye condition? Yeah, maybe he has like astigmatism and he's seeing, um... He's seeing something on me. What? No, you're not paying attention properly. Just listen. Your aura. Since we first spoke, I've been studying it. It does not it does not resemble a living being's aura at all. This feels like the lead into a scam. Are you trying to tell me I'm dead? Maybe I'm dead. Yeah, sure. Are you trying to tell me I'm dead? Ugh. Do they have one for, um, <clears throat> balls, perchance? No, unfortunately. So sorry you're late. Why are you sorry? Absolutely no need to be sorry. Nobody should be sorry about being late. Just be sorry you couldn't be here sooner. Oh, wait. That's, that's sorry for late. Never mind. You are not dead. The aura of the dead is... Like smoke, I suppose. It has a strong stench. And it is thick. Yours is not like that either. I'M NOT GIRTHY! No! Where's all my girth? Where's it gone? I could have sworn that I was based. Uh, oh, wait, wait, my, my model. <laughs> Move over here. We're not on the video call anymore. I need like a video call hotkey so I can just swap between DMs and hot, and DMs and um, text with this what did you join what did you just join into oh i didn't want to hide the the cool little advertisements at the bottom they're very important to the story you know they're not <clears throat> yours is not like that either so what is my soul like then like sunlight shine like sunlight shining through a fog but when i look but when I look closer, it's like a mirage. Like it's there, but it's not. The colors are strong, yet empty. That seems like a contradiction to me. Are you stupid, Grim? And that is why it is like a mirage. It's, it does not make sense. Have you been cursed? Or maybe made a blood promise, then broke it? A blood what now? Yes, I was cursed after breaking a blood promise six moons ago. Should I lie to him? Yeah, I'm gonna lie to him. Yes, I was cursed after breaking a blood promise six moons ago. <laughs> we are fucking under attack! I love that meme so much. <gasps> this is crucial information. Why would you withhold this? The curse will not allow me to say. I, if I speak of the details, it will drain my life force away forever. <laughs> that would make sense. And would explain some of the symptoms. What is this ERP we're starting here? We're just starting this canon fandom. And not only that... My blood now bleeds black. As dark as the night sky. Dot, dot, dot. 
Are you fooling around right now? <laughs> I hate how he types like I can hear... I Like, I can literally hear Zanny with all of the responses that Grimmy gives me. Obviously. Seriously, Grim? Blood promises? Curses? Have you gone insane? So sorry. Have you gone even more insane? What am I supposed to do for you to understand? If you start making sense, then I'll understand. We need Zanny to play this game? Uh, <laughs> yeah, about that. He played this before I did. Kinkaru, thank you for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Today's your birthday. You're giving your special birthday buff to me so you risk death twice as hard? Oh, wow. You don't say. Ahem. Ahem. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Hinkaru. Happy birthday to you. <gasps> I have an idea. You know what? After this whole weird conversation, I don't know if I like the thought of you having an idea. Also, hi Cass, how are you doing today, buddy? Mwah. You still do not believe my words. By the way, my chest feels so much better after the, do, after doing that long that long hold. <gasps> Happy birthday to you. You just thought the thumbnail was Cass, to be honest. He's interchangeable with Grimmy. I would riz up Cass in a heartbeat. If this dude was on the other side of my DMs right now, I would be like, hey, yo, elf boy, mind showing me the tree to Yggdrasil? Because I've got a tree in my pants that would like to see your tree. Is your... Yeah, I can try. I suppose it will have to do. So, what is this idea of yours then? God, I want to do a cooking stream right now, just because I'm so hungry. I want to just cook food and make food for you guys. Not for you guys, obviously, for me, but like, I want to cook food. Gah. So what is this idea of yours then? I am going to channel some of my life force into you. Oh my god, he's going in! He's going in me, chat! We finally made it! We made a home run! Brilliant. Oh, how I've always dreamed of just that. Then maybe you will take me seriously. On the first date? I think it's our third date. I think this is the third night that we're talking to Grimmy and he's already going inside. As a reaper, it will it will pose no challenge to me. In theory. Uh, uh I'm, guys, what are you? What sort of chatter are you? Are you an um er kind of chatter? Are you a hmm kind of chatter? Or are you a Um, er, <laughs> um, er, actually. <laughs> How exactly does one channel life force? You're so tired of this dude. <laughs> what the fuck did I do to you? Well, <laughs> I'm just having a good time today. You, you come in here, killing my vibe. What have I done to deserve this? Hey puppy, if you're gonna pee, pee now in your diaper. I see you, you're sniffing around like you want to. Hey!
I had to be strict there for a second. I'm sorry. I hope I did not frighten you, chat. I almost called you children. I almost called you guys children instead of chat. <laughs> Is that what you guys are to me now? You guys are really my children. Told you guys found something to be distracted by. It's just... Wait, are you talking about puppy? Your dog's wearing a diaper? Yeah, only when I'm streaming. He has to wear it because he cannot be trusted by himself at the moment. Dad, is that you? Yeah, I got the 2%. Would you like a glass? I'll pour you one right now. Gluck, 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 gluck. Hmm, oops, did I drink your milk? Guess I'll have to go get some more. Sorry, I'll be right back. Hey, I brought the milk. Good ending. <laughs> the good ending. I brought the milk back, guys. Places it in the fridge so we don't have to get more for a while. How exactly does one channel life force? And what does that even mean? I know I've been playing along with your whole Grim Reaper thing. But you've just gotten a buttload stranger. Oof. Can we not use such profanity on stream, please? I'm trying to keep this family friendly. How did I drink up the entire carton of milk so fast? What can I say? I'm good at swallowing. I have not lied to you even once since we've met. If you want to prove that, then look into my eyes. I, I will form a connection between us. Right. Right. I see. The eyes can be seen as a gateway to one's soul. Can be seen as or are. These are two very different interpretations, Grimmy, and I need you to clarify right here, right now, what the hell you mean by that. The eyes can be seen as a gateway to one's soul, and it is necessary to form the bridge between us. A bridge. Of course. Can't say a guy's ever wanted to make a mind bridge with me before. I guess this is considered docking. Then I'm glad to be your first and only. Yes, this should work. Once a connection is formed, I will transport a part of my conscience to you. Yo, what? You've been here since day one and, you're, and my out-of-pocket unsay-so responses still get you? Good. I'm glad the whiplash is still working. He's pulling his conscience out! <laughs> is this like a demonic possession? Can I say no? This is so totally normal. Guys, I am so normal about this. It is not an ability many have. So normally, it is not. Will it hurt? If you resist, it will. The connection will become unstable. And your mind will fight me like the body would fight an infection. But know that I am stronger, so it is un it is likely your mind would fracture if it were to resist against me. Dot, dot, dot. We are fucking under attack! You know, this game's good. Because it's gonna keep my channel, um... Not demonetized. Because of... Uh, they don't curse. Unlike me. Uh, I am, <laughs> I am the sole bearer of the reason that all my streams get, uh, ad limited. But this game, this game puts me on the straight and narrow. So thank you, A Date With Death. Thank you for keeping my channel safe. Fracture? What does that mean? Your mind would fall apart. You will lose the ability to understand life. Oh, I'll become a sociopath. Essentially, you will lose yourself. I wouldn't be me anymore? No. You would be a husk. An empty shell of yourself. Typically a perfect vessel for a demon to inhabit. And they really are a hassle to deal with. So, let's not do that, yeah? The straight and narrow? Yes, the straight and narrow. 
What do you want me to say? The gay and narrow? Is that what you wanted? Was that the joke you you craved? You're gonna break you so you thought you'd pop in for a bit. Hello. Hello. So this is a consensual possession, huh? And if I change my mind. Boom. Demon time. When you put it like that, it makes sense. It sound it makes it sound like I'm doing something forbidden. Possession sounds pretty forbidden, NGL. NGL stands for not going to lie. It is an abbreviation of the phrase not going to lie. Used to save on text space in DMs and chat rooms. It doesn't really fall under the classification of possession unless I forcibly take control of your body. So you aren't breaking any underworld. So you aren't breaking any underworld rules then, or any or anything then. Dot dot dot. You a Nazi boy. How many rules are you about to break? Does it matter? Also, when you call me a Nazi boy, it gives me a strange feeling. I am unsure if it's a good one or not. Guys, can we go back in time? I, I want to take that back. Guys, can I go back in time? I don't I don't want to call Grimmy a naughty boy anymore. I'd I'd prefer if, I'd prefer if I didn't make this choice. What? What do you say? What do you say? He oh he said can we call or something like that? Please don't be naked. Wow, I love talking to a blank screen. Ugh. I suppose it is needed. Fine. Whatever. Oh! Thank God! Happy now? You don't look very hurt. What? You said... It is not something visible to the eye. Nor is it anything for you to think heavily on, so no need to bring it up. Can't can't you just tell me, Grim me? Yeah, I thought I was gonna get meat spin live on stream. I thought Grimmy was gonna be out of pocket for some reason. I don't like thinking you're hurt and not understanding how. Oh my god. I really am turning into a Discord kitten, but if this is what gets me the nitro. I gotta move myself. <laughs> Ugh, water. Grimmy's not you, Captain. I'm not a Discord kitten either. It is simply my mind. Oliver, are you on speaker? Yeah, tell me now, Oliver. Yeah, let me know. I'll um <laughs> I'll call for the I'll call for the uh, the people there. I'll let them know um what you're watching. Your mind? You just put earbuds in. You're not taking that risk. <laughs> uh, painter Sean, painter's Sean. Should this mind connection join you thingy not wait then? You know until you're recovered. Dot, dot, dot. Won't it make it worse? I suppose that would be the sensible thing to do. But it is nothing I haven't dealt with before. Let's go ahead with it. Is this not dangerous for your health? Shut up, my character! As long as I don't delve into your mind too deep, it will be fine. What if the painters were men? Would I still call them Chan? Yes. Because they're cute. Because they're cute little painters. Uh, well, if you say so. Yep, I'm on board. Okay, so I just look at you? Just... Yes? Don't look away until the connection is formed. How will I know when it's formed? You will feel it. 
And I shall tell you, of course. What about that resistance? Once I've connected to you, my conscience will merge with yours. You should feel me around you. Just try not to push me away. If you try to force me out, it will cause an imbalance in our connection. God damn, I'm so tired. Oh, yeah. I don't want to be tired. You aren't going to make me do weird things, right? Are you going to take control of my body? That's a good question. Don't be ridiculous. This isn't some party trick. You want me to prove I'm serious. And I want answers. This is mutually beneficial. So once you're in, you're going to do... What exactly? Look for said answers. Which means... Nine hells, you ask so many questions. I'm about to hypothetically let you into my mind. Of course I'm gonna have questions. Lunch break over to work? Uh, back to work? Oof. I'm holding the temptation back to just start moaning for no reason. Just completely end, like, no reason. Have a good day at work. I hope that the bed bugs don't bite when you fall asleep at your job. Maybe I'm self-inserting. Maybe I'm just tired. I almost sound like I really believe you. Maybe I am the real crazy one. I am going to examine your aura. Feel it. <laughs> Smell it. That almost sounds gross. <laughs> Surely you could have phrased that a little better. That almost sounds gross. And maybe it will give me answers on what is stopping me from completing this godforsaken task. Oh my god, speaking of godforsaken, hello, is that the demon of Avalum? Mr. Netherbrand, thank you for the, uh, the redirect, hope you were doing well. How was the coffee? Uh, I'm assuming Lucin's here too, hello Lucy. Mwah, mwah. To the two of you, mwah, mwah. Good morning. I'm a... I'm a... Oh. I'm tired. Again. Ugh. I'm so tired. Hope you guys are doing quite well today. My name's Captain Gale Galleon of First Stage Productions EN Group Avalum. The first generation of... Oh. My head's getting dizzy. Oh. Uh. Hi, chat. I think I need, um, a snack. I love you guys. Uh, give me two seconds. I'm gonna grab chips. I'm gonna grab chips. It's literally gonna take like one second, I promise. Like literally one second. Wait, what does Annie say? Get your hands off my man. <laughs> Come on. What's a love triangle to a couple of bros, you know? Sorry, I had to grab some chips. Um, My body feels very faint and weak right now. I think because of the lack of sleep, unfortunately. It's okay, Zanny. I'll fall for you. You can fall for Grimmy. And then Grimmy can fall for me. <laughs> Get water. I've been drinking water. No worry. And I think I, need, I think I do need to take a, a VA break though. I was getting dizzy from um, breathing so much. I think it's the um, the voice that I was doing for Grimmy, the very breathy and um, the very Xander-like accent that I'm putting on for him is drawing a lot of breath out of me, so my oxygen reserves are slowly depleting. Mm, mm, mm. So I've got chips. Sorry for um, the quick break. This is so uncalled for and unprofessional, but I legitimately felt woozy for a second there, so I hope you can forgive me. Which I know you guys will. I know you guys won't hate me for taking care of myself. 
Get in call and Zanny can voice Grim. Zanny, are you up for that? Can you hear me? Are you still watching, Zanny? Are you up for that? Would you actually want to do that? Or would that be weird? If that's weird for you, because um, if this is a date with death, I, I'm totally okay with not doing it. Don't feel pressure to. You can say no. You can say no. I know you have things to do today, too. I'm sure. Also, if he doesn't respond, guys, then um, everything's fine. I don't want to force him into a position that he wasn't already prepared for. Hmm. If you guys are curious, I'm eating... Cheddar and sour cream chips. They are... They are chips with ridges in them. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I, I eat so slow. Huh. Okay. Okay. Let me take a sip of water. And lick my fingers clean. You think he's gone? Yeah, probably gone. I actually see him in the uh, the collab room with Lucy still. So they're probably busy. They're probably busy talking to each other. Discussing things. Okay. I think for a date with death, I'm not used to doing so much voice acting at once. I know I've done it before, but... um. Wait, I want more, I want one more chip actually. See? I think I will have to take care of myself and take breaks periodically, unfortunately. Ugh. I really need to like get used to taking breaks uh during stream, don't I? It would probably help my endurance a lot more. Usually, guys, low key, the reason that I end a lot of streams is because I get hungry. <laughs> it's because I stream and I get hungry and I have to go make food. So I end stream. If I ate during stream, guys, imagine. Imagine the power at our fingertips if I was to stream and eat at the same time. We'd be unstoppable. I want to be bigger. I want to be bigger. I want to be as big as Grimmy here. <laughs> oh, Grimmy. What am I to do with you? you? Beautiful young. He's got the same hair as me! He just notices. I. I never noticed his hair is just longer than mine, but we have the same style. We both have that, the, the, the wife that like the, the single mom haircut in anime where the mom always dies. Maya, thank you very much for the super chat. Thank you. Thank you. It was fun chilling out for an hour, but sadly got to head out and finalize the work presentation. Take it easy and enjoy stream and get your man, Captain. Gamba, Gamba, -ru. you Gamba as well. Good luck on your work presentation. I hope it goes well. Thank you for the super chat, of course, by all means. Um, feel free to pick up the VOD. The VOD is always going to be there. At least in most cases, unless I do something heinous. Where's my ponytail? You can kind of see it. Not the dead mom hair. I am destined for death. That's how I'm going to get close to Grimmy. That's why we have this haircut. He's dead, and I'm just waiting for my time to come. We have the Chuya haircut. What is it? Chuya. Let me Google that. Chuya. Is that, oh, is that a character? Oh, from Stray Dogs. Nyarudo. I got you. I got you. I'm on the same page. All right, now I'm actually ready to get back into it. Sorry. Let's get right back into it, guys. Shall we? Uh, the last thing we were talking about was something. Wait a second. Seeing as you keep mentioning that you want to, you know, kill me. How do I know this isn't a trick? 
Why do we keep... We keep, like... We keep blue balling this connection. I want it to happen already. Hmm. I suppose that's a fair comment. I will do nothing to harm you. You can trust me. Trust the guy wanting to take my soul. Right. I cannot lie. I will not touch a single hair on your head. Fine. I believe you. Well, are you prepared? I will trust you with my soul, Grim. Uh huh. Yeah, come at me, Grim. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. Stay still and prepare yourself. You unironically started saying "let me out" after watching me. Get fucked. Ha ha ha. You love mentioning shows and just spawning fandoms. They just come out of the walls. <laughs> oh, they all come out of the walls. Dot dot dot. Nearly there. Grim. Shush. Don't break my concentration. Are you sure this is... Stop wiggling. You will cause irreparable damage and it will be your fault entirely. I will not feel sorry for you. Just keep your eyes on me. I am. There you are. Ah! Monochrome! Everything's gone inverted! Ah! Wait, the, the next line was ah. It's... Something feels strange. The connection is stable. Which is lucky, by the way, because of all of your wriggling. You... were serious about the whole possession thing. I think I'm going to faint. Uh. He's inside me now. He's inside me! Chat! Chat, get him out! Chat, pull him out! He's got his consciousness inside me! Consciousness is another word for... Well, let's just say. How is this possible? <laughs> Gas being the DM. <laughs> Thankfully, Grim rolled a nat 20 on his, um, on his wisdom check, and he was able to maintain the concentration spell. And, um, the connection stabilized on us. Cassian informs us, You are now connected. Your consciousnesses are merged. <laughs> Anyone heard that sound from Yale, though? Which one? All of them? I do a lot of sounds. I'm kind of a sussy little boy, you know? It's kind of gay. Yeah. Yeah, I guess it is, isn't it? I'm gonna stop being gay for the rest of the stream. I think it's only fair. This isn't a trick, is it? I mean, I can't even think of a way you would trick me. There's no tricks. You and I are now linked. Even you can tell that. Would a regular mortal be able to do that? Wait a second, I never claimed you were normal. That much was obvious. Even you could tell how extraordinary I am. That makes sense. You're good at making compliments out of things that aren't compliments. This guy is Delulu, this grim guy. Thank you. When gay people turn off their gay selves. By the way, it feels cold. You feel cold. What? I'm cold? That's you, right? That cold feeling. I'm surprised you can feel that. Our connection is stable, sure, but... You really were... serious this whole time? You're... Actually the Grim Reaper? Yes. <laughs> mm, yes. Wait, one sec. I gotta...
do something real quick. Here. Puppy? I thought I heard him. Oh, I thought I heard him like about to vomit. He was just choking on something. I mean, uh, barking. He was barking, not choking on something. Sorry. He was barking at something. Puppy fine. Puppy fine. Puppy fine. False alarm. Bro, he came inside us before we realized it was supernatural. Well, that's how you build a bond with somebody. You come inside of them. And then they'll never let you go. Your consciousness. You pull your consciousness into them. You th you theoretically come inside of them with your consciousness. Put the puppy on stream. We don't want you anymore, Gail. I hate you guys. I hate you guys so much. Grimmy's boy now for the rest of the stream. Sorry guys. I'm Grimmy's boy. I'm sitting on his lap. I'm the discord kitten now Yes Has I been telling you this entire time I am always truthful it Seems that you'll finally start to believe me How could that be possible? That is a question bigger than you or I it simply is. Anyway, do you feel that? Dot, dot, dot. This feels itchy. It's a puppy? I'm not a puppy! I'm a real man! I'm a real man on Grimmy's lap! I'm laying on his tummy. Uh, not that feeling. That's just an itch. The connection, you moron. It feel- I feel it. Like a pull. Good. Oh god. Does he have like a leash on me now? Wait, I'm on the text. I just realized. I'll be the devil on his right shoulder. Does he have a leash on me? Metaphorically and... Mentally? That's crazy. Can you see through my eyes? How does this work? Not until I transfer a part of my consciousness into you. You haven't done that yet? No. All I've done is just link us together. Think of it as a bond of sorts. Part of myself will flow through your aura. And then my conscience will be inside of you. And then I could, technically, see through your eyes. That makes absolutely no sense. Of course, I mean, it, makes per it, it makes perfect sense. I want to be big again. I'm sorry to be small. Hi. Chat, you, know, you guys never get to see my face up this close to you. Hey. You guys are pretty cute today. Any reason you're why you're over there? And not right here with me. Uh, it's because there's a there's a monitor between us, that's why. That's the reason why. Obviously. I'm too big. Sniffs you? What the fuck are you doing? I want to just dick around. My ADHD is like acting up so bad. I want to just dick around on stream all day. Wait, what happened? Where'd he go? 
Me? I'm right here in plain sight. <laughs> Do it. You guys are such an enabler. Can you see the puppy? No. I don't think you can. Pretty sure you can't, right? He's not even here with me anymore. He left. I left my left my door open today, so he's free to go as he pleases. Um, how about this? I'm going to turn myself into a a spinner on Grimmy's forehead. Do the DVD screensaver again? Have I ever done that? you guys don't worry <laughs> change color i can't change color <laughs> i can't change color unfortunately wait can i wait wait a second you're making me wonder about that Guys, we pulled a holographic Gale Galleon. Guys, we got that. We got that. We got that ultra rare. We got the ultra rare Gale Galleon. Y'all are dumb. <laughs> Y'all are dumb. I'm gonna go pee really quick. I've been drinking so much water to keep myself hydrated. Let me go. Um. Let me go use the facilities really quick before I continue my talking with Grimmy. Two seconds. I'm sorry. I'm stalling so hard today. I don't mean to. I, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to. Oh, who am I to not bring Pip onto the show? It's Pip. Get him, Pip. Risk up the Grimmy. Ah! 
Pip, stop, stop saying naughty words on stream and stop playing the game for me. I'm trying to stay attached to this. Yo, May Anamaru, thank you for the super chat. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so glad that I saw the notification for that. Thank you for the good laugh. Your abs, your abs. Hey, have a good workout. Have a good workout. Thank you for the super chat. I appreciate it. Okay, Eddie, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go see what Grimmy's all about. I don't trust you, but let's do it anyway. What a fantastic baseball partnership. How was the piss? Wouldn't you like to know, weather boy? In my defense, you are trying to kill me. Bogsley, thank you for the super chat. Thank you. Thank you. You're doing great, Pip. Keep up the good streamy, my beloved Pip. Banish! Pip! Did I wash my hands? Of course I washed my hands. I'm trying to help you pass on. I'd say that's just slightly nicer than murder. Anyway, how do we do this? Give her back? Okay. Picture our connection. A bridge. Okay, I can imagine a bridge. Oh yeah, it's a huge bridge. Very impressive. Congratulations. One side is yours and the other side is mine. I am simply going to walk across the bridge with part of my conscience. What do I do? When I tell you, you simply close your eyes. Is that a soundboard or the game? That's a soundboard. That's, that's Pip's arrival and disappearance. But hold tight to the handles, okay? That is the pull of my mind. What happens if I don't feel this pull anymore? That would only happen if the connection became unstable. And if that happens, it would be too late. Carla, thank you for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. I personally think Pip should pursue a voice acting career. She's so talented. I'm going to throw her into a window because she's trying to take my job. Just kidding, I can't actually grab her. The fracturing would have begun. Then that shouldn't be a worry, right? As long as you don't push me away, yes. Got it, boss. Good. Whew. I'm going to be cro I'm going to begin crossing. Take a deep breath and remain calm. I'm cheering for you, baby girl. You're already distracting me. This is honestly the stupidest idea I've ever had. Also, what is this? What is with this baby girl thing? How am I baby girl? I didn't want him to pursue this line of dialogue. I regret my actions yet again. I once again am the con I am reaping the consequences of my actions. This is how kids nowadays refer to intercourse. You gotta get your bridge. You gotta go on one side of your bridge. And hold the bridge. Hold the bridge ropes. Then your partner comes in. And he crosses the bridge. Onto your side of the bridge. And then... Baby. You're about to leave stream, but after hearing that, your Pip Protection Squad sense called. She's fine. Don't worry. Pip is protected. Submissive and bri Oh, I mean, sorry. You're just sweet like that. What were you about to say? Submissive and what? Don't worry about it. Now I'm worried about it. We can come back to this later. For now, let's just worry about not getting either of us killed. Oh, so Grimmy can actually be harmed from this as well. Okay. When I've made it across, you can open them again. Huh. 
Huh. That doesn't make any sense. Interesting. Grim... Maybe this is a bad idea. I'm scared that if I... Mortal, calm down. Stop worrying so much. As long as you stay calm, then nothing will go wrong. Sorry. I'm calm. Oh, yeah! I'm fine! I'm fine! I trust you! That was too close. You seriously know how to stress me out. I'm better now. Sorry. I'm nearly there. Stay composed for a little while longer. I'm a cross. Open your eyes, mortal. I... How do you feel? Kind of full? Pip, you're too young to be seeing this. Uh, anyway, I feel full. Well, you have a little more soul than usual in you right now. Now let's take a look at what, you, what that aura of yours up. Now let's take a look at that aura of yours up close. Ah. What is it, doctor? What's my diagnosis? How did you? How could that? Wait a second. I can hear you in my head. Yes. I should have mentioned that this connection has benefits and drawbacks. It is not permanent. Damn, I can think of a lot of situations this would be fun in. Dot, dot, dot. And those situations would be... I can see the regret happening already. I can literally feel the regret that is yet to come. Do it. I mean, you guys haven't said no balls, so I'm not really obligated to. Do no balls. Well, if you push my arm. Your mind is in the gutter once again. Mortals can be truly filthy. Yes. I imagine for certain acts, it would be quite enjoyable for both parties. Yeah, have you ever heard anyone talk about that? I have not. Creamy's a virgin? Perhaps for science we can try it out one day. Oh my fucking god. Can't have shit in here without... Why does this game exist? Guys, 
Guys, no backseating. Guys, guys, no backseating. No backseating. Sarcasm. Do it all balls. Well, that's true. I... Uh, <coughs> like... Keep it in mind for next time, huh? They give me so many outs. Guys, I've been given three lifelines. If this was Jeopardy, I have used all three of my lifelines and I've wasted them. I literally used them because I'm on the final question. And I said, fuck it. I don't need to. I don't need to use my lifelines. Throws them in the trash. Did it empty balls? I have not emptied my balls today. Grimmy, want some help with that then? I... How can you be so forward? You're fun to tease. Sorry. Anyway. <laughs> well, that just happened. So, can you see my aura? I can see it, yes. Mind you, I could see it before, too. Now I can feel it, I suppose. It feels... Um... Sparse. Is that bad? Not exactly what I want a pretty man to call me, but okay. Is that bad? Hmm. I am unsure at the moment. It's... I don't know what it means. You have some serious RBF? Is that, is that like a like a tummy issue? Is that like a is that like a hot girl tummy issue acronym? That is RBF. Rich boy face. Rude boy face. Resting bitch face. I knew it was a face. You have some serious resting bitch face right now. Bro, how nobody nobody abbreviates RBF with as resting bitch face. Gulp. Hey, why are you pulling that kind of ugly face? You look kind of built up right now. What is number three? I'm gonna do it. What do you mean? They have pills to help you clear out those old pipes, you know. What the? My pipes are just fine, thank you. Fine, but what's with the face? Oh! His ass! They were talking about constipation. When I hear pipes, I don't think of I don't think of the ass. I think of the cock. It's bright. You're too bright. No, you're bright. I've already told you this already. Pay more attention. What's wrong with bright things anyway? All right, you don't like the light, do you? Pasty ass. Do you sparkle in the sunlight like that vampire from that movie? What? No. It just... It hurts my eyes to look at too closely, that's all. That's not a pipe, that's a tube. So what do they mean when the plumber's coming down to lay some pipes at your mom's house? What does that mean then? Grim says, I'm just a little sensitive, okay? I bet you are. Be careful not to damage your eyes then. Or maybe we should do it then. Be careful not to damage your eyes then. I'm so damn bright. Don't look too close, all right? Fantastic advice, except I must look closely if I'm to work out what exactly is wrong with you. But if it hurts you, that makes me feel kind of bad. I need an option too where I don't feel bad. I'll deal with it. So... Are souls supposed to be that bright? Sometimes. Souls can shine or glow. Like yours. It's rare, but not unheard of. Grim says, What? I didn't mean... I meant my eyes. My eyes! What is he talking about? Oh, talking about his... But... Hmm... 
Yours doesn't look the same, nor feel the same as anyone else's. I'm a shiny version? I'm a shiny Pokemon? Whoa! Shiny Gale! Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! I'm a shiny Pokemon Gale! Gale version shiny! Let's go! My shiny form is this color. I'm the shiny Gale. I'm the cooler Gale, and I'm shiny. Maybe you should try smelling it. You did say you were going to do that, right? It has no scent. Throws Avalon Ball. Huh! I gotta get out of here! Dodge. Sorry, I'm power gaming. Dodge is the Pokeball. Back to normal. Guys, quick Master Ball. I gotta get out of here! <laughs> do a backflip. I don't want to do a backflip. I'll get sick. Whoa! 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 whoa. Shad, you have immense power over me. What's happening? Too powerful. Was that like a Pokemon command? Did I get caught accidentally? Anyway, I'm gonna play the game again. I'm gonna play the game. Spam! That's what I'm saying. That honestly sounds like a good thing. <laughs> what the lack of smell tells us is that you are indeed not cursed. That's a front flip. I'm not doing that again. Which is good, but it still doesn't explain anything. Close your eyes again. It helps me to concentrate. Okay. Hmm. My hand is behind my back. No, it's not. You can see both of my hands. See? I just strike a sassy pose is all. A very commanding pose. Hmm. What the? What the bloody hell? Sorry, I turned him British for a second there. At least more British than I've already been turning him. What is it now? Grim. Open. Uh. Oh, my eyes. So, give me the diagnostics, Doc. In all my years, I've never seen anything like this before. What is it? Are you gonna tell me what's wrong? It's... You. Shoutouts to the TV gang. Yep, just keeping you guys on toes. You guys have plenty of opportunities to switch to headphones. And you're watching A Day With Death, so honestly... Anything that happens is your fault, not mine. But me? Close your eyes again. What? No, start explaining. Just do as you're told. You could say please, you know. Please. I am the best of the best. He says, there is no one better on your plane or mine than I. I am everything people should strive to be. Steve at it again. I like the positivity. It is an undisputable fact. Yet I can't make any sense of this. Maybe you're not the best of the best then. Nonsense, that is not an option. If anything, this is a problem with you, not me. Wow. Ouch! Yikes, that really hurt! Your aura, it's... It pulses and ebbs. Pulses? When you close your eyes, it's pulses. Open them again for me. And now? Now it ripples. The colors flow like oil on water. 
Maybe it's maybe something is protecting me. Is there something you need protection from? Uh, that, that would be you, Grimmy. I won't harm you. I've told you such. Yeah, you won't harm me this time. But you're still after my soul, right? Correct. But not today. I am still... Not as my full strength. I'm not quite sure I believe you, but for now, let's pretend I do. That is fair. So, no answers? You can't rush perfection. No, but I can rush you. I will look more into it later. There must be something mentioned in a tome somewhere. Pulsating auras. And then there's your other issue. Other issue? Until I understand what's going on, it's best that you don't ask questions. I know that will be difficult for you. Blem. Out of all of the mortals in existence, you must be the one who asks the most questions. Why can't I ask questions? Would you look at that? Another question. Ah. <sighs> Knowledge is dangerous, especially if it's wrong. So, you'll tell me once you know more? Perhaps. Maybe if you behave or beg. I'd rather not. Then perhaps I'd rather not tell you. That's not fair. I, I think that's pretty fair. Okay, uh, yo. Uh, main character Kun, that was that was pretty fair, yeah. Those were good options. The only thing fair in life is death. Okay, very funny. I think it's time for me to go. Time is ticking. Now? So suddenly? I need rest. And I need I need answers. The answers will be coming first. Do you think perhaps you could be a workaholic? Pfft, nah, no way. You can relate to the MC asking questions. I want to know about this enigma of a man too. What's this dealio? Stretch. Sorry, stretching. Still waking up. My body is so... Oh my gosh. I stretched and all of a sudden I'm seeing in 144p. My frame rate just shot up for some reason. That's crazy. My well-being comes second to my responsibility. The responsibility of being the Grim Reaper. That is correct. I still can't believe it. You're not very threatening. I can be plenty threatening when I want to be. You just haven't seen that side of me yet. Blood rush to the head? How do I keep it there? Should I do jumping jacks? Should I do some jumping jacks to get my blood flowing? I'm standing up to stretch. Let me, um, do this. <clears throat> breathe deeper? I feel like if I breathe deeper, I'm gonna get, a, like, dizzy. Like I am right now. Oh god. <sighs> Guys, let's do a workout stream next week. I think I need to. I think I'm getting lazy. I've been streaming so much. I haven't been active. I wish I had like ring fit or something like that. That'd be nice. Make my job a lot easier to work out. Man, I really want ring fit now. Fuck. I really want ring fit! Whatever. I'll just shut up for now. Then show it to me. Not today. Wait, why did I turn it into like a... Like a Cockney accent? Cockney. <laughs> Not today. Ugh. 
Water. Water. I think I'm genuinely, like, deteriorating. Captain hasn't been very active, so... All of my... My entire body's, like, not shutting down, per se, but it's... It's feeling the consequences of not working out. Plus, working out is a good way of generating... Um, what is it? What's the what's that feel good hormone again? Serotonin. It's really good at generating serotonin. So, am I shrimping? No, I don't shrimp. I have good posture. I should go for a run after the stream. Maybe I can take a little pup on a walk. A long walk. Well, I guess running would be better though. I wonder if the little pup would run with me. You know what else is good at generating serotonin? Yeah, candy. Sugar. It's not eating veggies. Punches you in the mouth. Eat this veggie. It's a knuckle sandwich with kale. Am I old? I'm 28 years old. I mean, young. 28 years young. Then I don't believe you. Mortal, I do not lie. So you've said. He's totally lied before, though. When he was talking about his usage of emojis and stuff like that. At the very least, he's not being honest. Gale, do you like FNAF? Uh, I watched the FNAF movie. Does that make me... Does that mean I like FNAF? If so, then yeah. But I haven't played any of the games. That's a little off topic, though. I'm not going to I'm not going to go down the uh, the FNAF rabbit hole while we're playing a date with death. I should be eating veggies, though. That would help. I need like antioxidants and stuff like that. Oh, you know what I have? I have strawberries. I'll be right back. I have strawberries that I could wash right now. strawberries guys i'm so sorry like i know i keep apologizing this is like i think okay I'm, I'm gonna say it my honest opinion i think this has probably been the worst stream that i've done so far i'm glad you guys are enjoying it if you are though but god i do not feel in today you know i feel very not in um i think once this chapter once this part of um a day with death ends i might just turn into a glorified zatidon because I I'm just I'm very out of the out of the zone right now, you know? I think it's a part of it being tired, but also like a part of it's um I don't know. My equilibrium feels shifted. Alright. Let me uh let me have a bite of the straw baby. Hmm. Strawberry. Mm -mm. that's exactly what a liar would say oh my gosh these strawberries are so good actually oh my god they're not too sweet they're not overly sweet they're like perfect they're so perfect i'm hanging up now 
try to not miss gazing into my eyes too much. Mlem. Take a rest when you need it. I rested last week though. And on Sunday. Like genuinely, today's just like a, I need to like, like I'll do like some workouts in Zatsu after I finish this uh, day up in A Date With Death. Cause I think I need it. So I'll do like an impromptu workout. Today doesn't feel like a deal with that thing. I should have streamed it later tonight. I think I should have changed my time to be later in the night, unfortunately. No, no, thank you for the super chat. Thank you. Thank you. What matters most is your health. Do what makes you comfortable, Captain. Yeah, but I also have an obligation to you guys. Unfortunately, my health comes second to you guys. I care about y'all. Susie G, thank you for the super chat. Thank you. Thank you. Don't worry, Captain. This is seriously the funniest shit I've seen all day. Clippers are going to have a field day with this stream. Good. I'm glad. Glad that I put up a show at least. Pregnant? Wait, what? He's pregnant. Am I pregnant? My health priority? Yeah, but so is your guys's. And if your guys's health is your is my priority and my health is your guys's priority, then it balances out. If I was so selfish as to prioritize myself, then who's going to take care of you guys, huh? That's a joke, by the way. I do take care of myself, by the way. I was just I was just playing it up. Sorry, don't actually be concerned for me. I do take care of myself. Kelly Prego. Yep, I got a baby. I got a consciousness baby inside of me. All right. You told me I had to. Indeed. But you stared long after you needed to. You're always staring at me, aren't you? Question or exclamation point. Oh wait, should I do the should I do the bottom behavior stutter? My name is Boy Biscuit after all. What's the baby's name? I think I'm gonna name it Boy Biscuit 2, the sequel to Boy Biscuit 1. Food baby? Yeah, I mean if their name is Boy Biscuit 2, in a way they're a food baby. And what if I said yes? I've got you wrapped around my finger, little mortal. And what if I said I didn't mind that? I would say that you're making a mistake, obviously. The only place I will lead you is to your doom. Remember that. Grimmy kind of... Grimmy kind of bad with it, and by bad, I mean good. Well, if anything, I'd say I have you wrapped around my finger. And how did you come to that conclusion? You're like a little puppy that I'm leading around by the collar. So you wish to collar me? Understandable. I would look fantastic in a collar. And that's enough day with death. I think that's enough. I think that's enough a day with death for today. <laughs> what the hell, Grimmy, are you talking about? What is blood talking about? This guy is into it. Guys, low key. Chokers are one of my favorite accessories to see on somebody else. Chokers and thigh highs. I love that. Let me finish off my chips. the eyeballs emoji in chat right now be like oh 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 la meow la meow even <laughs> i bet you would i'm leaving now try not to get up to too much trouble while i'm gone thigh highs are god's gift to women lovers Amen. Amen. Say a prayer next to your bed every night, praying for thigh highs to come back in fashion. Oh, wait, get some rest, please. Wow, the game's talking to me. Wait, I'm role playing as chat in game, and Gail Galleon is Grimmy. That's why we have the same hair. We have the same work ethic. You could at least try to sound a little scared. Call ended. Aren't they still in fashion, though? They're certainly not popular. By the way... I'm assuming I can't tell people about you. 
absolutely not. Wait, so are we pregnant? Yeah, we got a we got a consciousness baby. If I find out you have told others of this, there will be hell to pay. Like anyone at all? A few years ago, you had one guy tell tell you that he liked jokers, and you were too young and innocent to understand what he meant by that. Oh, I like it as a fashion statement, purely. I think they look pretty. What were you guys thinking? I think they, they're aesthetic. What about garters? Garters are fine. They don't do anything for me, they're fine. They compliment thigh highs. Great, now someone made it awkward. <laughs> Guys, we're just talking about accessories and all of a sudden it's turning into kinks. Guys, I'm not saying I want to collar you. I'm saying that you would look nice in a collar. It's different. Anyway. Do you really have a death wish? <laughs> Maybe I just like pushing your buttons. I gotta move over. <laughs> you truly are infuriating. Thank you, Colin D. That this is this is this is this is a Gale coded reply right here. Just a thank you, Colin D, to someone being pissed off. By the way, I can't believe you changed your profile picture to that. You and your edgy teenager-like ass. I do not see what is funny about it. I did not want to be contacted. A solid black picture seemed to convey that. <laughs> it definitely did, little meow. I feel like you're being sarcastic, but I will allow it this once. He's gonna block me? He wouldn't. He doesn't have the balls to. This guy, this Grimmy guy, he's a huge pushover. Yo, how do I do this thing? Yo, how do I do this thing? How, how do I do this thing? There we go. What did I break? Freaking broke my balls just now. I literally just broke my balls. I feel good being sarcastic, but I will allow it this once. Go. Rest. You may not feel it, but your mind will need it after what happened. Nice to know you care. Or don't and suffer for it later. Your choice. I don't care either way such heartwarming support. Thank you. This guy is my be this guy's my BFF. I suppose I'll take it to heart this one time. Dot dot dot. I will take it. Eventually. What you take it, bro? What's blood taking, huh? My soul. That's my soul. The strawberry squishy. Unfortunate. That strawberry, the first bite was good. The rest of them were kind of mid. My heart? No, your chastity, you idiot. Your heart, your soul, you entirely. Well, he said it, not me. I, I called it. I called it. That's a bold claim. No other shall have you. Good night, sunshine. Who the hell is this guy I'm talking to? Who put him at the phone? New items added to the gallery. It's a leash. You can put this on if you're feeling like a bottom bitch. Today was a very strange day for you. 
As it turns out, the Grim Reaper is real. Real and video calling you like it's nothing. You spend the majority of the day at work, unable to be productive. How could you be after such a revelation? As you get back to your apartment, you're feeling a little pent up with energy and you decide to take the steps rather than the elevator. Just as you reach the floor, you hear a loud bang. A few people come out from their apartments to find out what happened. You later learn that the, the elevator had a mal malfunctioning cable and it snapped, plummeting multiple floors down. Suddenly, you're very glad to have walked. <gasps> it's Pup! Oh wait, I named Pup in this game Pup as well. That's so funny. All right, I need a good word. Mango. Man. Anima. Um. Um. Was that not intentional? I named the pup in this game before I named the pup behind me. Anime? No, it can't be A-N at the beginning. I thought Anima was a good pick. I thought it was very apropos for the moment. I'm gonna take a bite of the strawberry. Hmm. Hmm. Nam. No. Hmm. No. Mania? Mania? No, because man is... The, the first three letters, M-A-N, are in the wrong spot. Um... It can start with an N, or it can start with a different letter. Let's just, um, let's throw something to the wall. John... Ju 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 juice, um... Ju uh, judge. You! Used in the right spot. Okay. So what I did there was I used a different word with uh, with a ton of different letters to try to narrow down our options. Um, judge. Used in the right spot. So... Numa numa e. Nu... Mun... No. Ma... Mm. Muna. Human? Oh, wait. You're so right. That's it. That's gotta be it. You're so smart! You're so freaking smart, guys. Alright. What about, um... Uh, let's do it again. Prior. No, there's two R's in there. I wanna use five letters. Cool. L. Laser. Wow! Look at me! Seal. No. Um. Death? No, unfortunately, no. That'll be that'll be kind of co uh, coincidence, huh? Uh, Salem? Slate? Slate's a good word. Oh wait, shit! I didn't type the last letter. It still let me submit it, even though I didn't type the last letter. That's bullcrap. Wasn't slate though. Sales? No, it's not sasa lele. Steel. No, because the S isn't in the beginning spot. Mm, leads. Oof. Wait, deals. I literally solved it. Pog. One more. One more. One more. Rules. Sear. Uh, all right. Uh, um, uh, hold, hold, no, 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 that's stupid. Um, uh, let's just go with, um, hand, uh, handy. All right, so let's go with, sa, 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 lele, sa, sa, lele. 
Sa Sar S Sampa. We're not playing. We're not playing Honky Donk Star Rail. We're playing Date with Death. <laughs> we're not playing Honky Donk Star Rail. Saver. Ooh, I bet Saver. Oh no, wasn't it? That sound. That was a really good guess, though. Oh no, because the E was in a different spot. Never mind. It was a bad guess. Bad. Hmm. That got us nowhere. Although, actually, no, it does get us somewhere. It means that the R and the S aren't in the beginning, so it has to be something else. E er earns. Nope. Oh, crap. I don't know what the last letter is. If this is honk, if this is honk, 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 death star, why are we doing Sudoku? Um, you mean if this isn't, is there a Sudoku in Honky Donk Star Rail? Tears? No. Tears? Mm, no, because he's not here. Tars? Par sparse? Parse? Is there a P? Parse? It's parse! Let's go! Parse! Man, man, hearing the word parse just gives me Final Fantasy XIV flashbacks. In a good way, actually. Hmm. Shy baby. One more. <laughs> Your gray parse. <laughs> Check the gallery. Oh, shoot. This looks really good. His jacket with the sleeves. I like that a lot. It's less um, slutty. You know, I like that. But of course, I mean, he looks good as um, this side as well. Oh, there's a back view too. They got back shots. I like it less slutty. I like a little bit of modesty in clothes. I mean, come on. You guys can barely see my skin with this outfit, right? You got my neck and my wrist. That's it. I'll stand here while I'm looking at these. Sorry, I got a DM and I was looking at it. Concept arts, huh? This is cute. I wonder if this is like a real scan line of a loose leaf uh, page. Probably not, right? Because this looks like it was done on a program. Oh, this is cool. I want to see like the world. I think my, the one thing about this game that I wish I, I mean, I know it's like, um, you know, it's just a small company doing this, but I would love to see like the worlds of the underworld. Maybe I do eventually get to see that. Maybe I do eventually get to see that. Very cool. Smoky. This is like the intro screen. And then there's his uh, emotions. My waist speaks for itself. Stop staring at my waist. Pervert. It's the whooper! I mean, axolotl. Oh, it's becoming fleshed out. The non-canon cat. We all know the dog is the canon pick, after all. Uh, he's a lava lamp? Wait, how long has he had a lava lamp? Has he always had this? For a while, really? Oh, that's a pretty picture. This gives me like Ragnarok Online vibes. Oh, this strawberry's dented. It's broken. Sometimes you forget how pretty Gale is because I'm usually saying so much unhinged stuff. D does my does my voice blind your eyes or something like that? What the hell? I'm gorgeous. Look at me. No, nope. screw it. Yeah, look at me. Look how pretty I am. If you're um if you're on your phone, this will be a lot easier to see me. I'm so pretty. 
My voice is soothing. Sounded like it was causing some interference with somebody's vision. <laughs> no, it's your words. <laughs> Why do you hate me? Guys, this is the only concept art you need right here. Hey. How you doing, chat? Doing good today? It's just a Tuesday. It's the beginning of the week, but... There's plenty of sun coming up your way. I feel like I'm crooked. Do I look crooked? No? No? What if I just stayed this close and we just chatted for the rest of the day? With this music playing in the background. You know, screw it. Let me, uh, let me pick better music, actually. Music. Um, I wish I could put one on loop, but that's fine. No, it's, it's, it'll loop, it'll loop. I'll do its thing. Let me take another bite of my strawberry. Yeah, I don't know why. I feel so... Ah, yeah, I don't know why. I keep saying I don't know why, when I literally do know why. It's the puppies that keep me up at night. So, my energy's been very... Oh, this strawberry's dented on both sides. He's just like me for real, for real. Broken. It's okay. I'll still appreciate you. Yeah, the puppies... Keeping me up at night. I've been so cute this entire stream and have had you giggling. Thank you for making your smile today. Absolutely. I'm glad I can make your day. Thank you for the super chat, Idle Boys. I appreciate it. You have three... Kigits? Am I gonna get banned for saying that? What is a, what is a kigit? You aren't broken? Wrong! Everybody's a little bit broken. If somebody was perfect, they'd be pretty boring. What is a kigit? Kiggy? Kitty? Kiggy? I'm so enamored with trying to to see what they are typing. I'm pretty sure they're saying kitty. Smooch then flicks the forehead. Ow! Bitch. <laughs> Twink, what are you saying? They got kiggies. I don't know. I'm just chilling with you guys. We dumbed down the word to kiggy. All right. That's my new word for kitty now. Thank you. I'm stealing that. Every time I see a cat, I'm going to call it <gasps> kiggy. <laughs> Mmm, that is a, that is a very firm tip on that strawberry. You have goats, they are homosexual. That's so cool. I wish I had a homosexual goat. Are we risen chat? Are we busting? I'm just chilling with you guys. Pretty, um, I'm pretty low energy today and I didn't feel like I was doing a very good job of representing a day with death. Moreover, I was getting out of breath pretty easily, probably because of bad sleep. So, I'm just chilling with you guys. Let's talk about whatever you want to. Like, seriously, whatever you guys want to talk about. Any questions? Anything you guys are curious about? Anything you want to tell me? Your dog is gay. I guess they do have to take after their parents. My dog has, like, the stupidest look in his eyes. Like, if you look at him, he's so stupid looking. But I love him. He looks so dumb, that's why I love him. Kai, thank you for the super chat. Hi, Gail. Hi, Pip Swish. White day is a little closer, and, and so is Gail. Are we talking about kitties or kinks? We're talking about kitties. It's okay, get some rest when you can. We'd rather you have rest and be tired of stream. Yeah, I think right now, just chatting with you guys is rest enough. Like, you know, it's, it's weird. For some reason, I use a different type of breath when I'm voice acting for the game. And it's completely separate from when I'm like talking on stream or talking to you guys. Isn't that weird? Like, I have like a second set of lungs for talking to you guys and then for voice acting. It's bizarre. How do I feel about ponytails or people drawing me with like grunge clothing? What's my favorite type of aesthetic clothing? Um, I like business casual. I like dress shirts. Tucked in dress shirts, loose tie, or maybe untucked dress shirt and then like open dress shirt type stuff. That for me at least, I like that. Um, what was the rest of it? 
Um, for ponytails, um, I like ponytails on girls. When I, when I watched Harui Suzumiya back in the day, I got a ponytail kink back in the day, so... I think ponytails are great. Right, I'm not in a weird way, but I love the Gabriel so much. Your details are so good. Thank you. My mother's a very talented person. She really gave me the best genes. Strawberries are done. So I'm the reason schools don't allow ponytails? What? Is that a thing nowadays? Wait, catch me up. What is school like for you guys now? You guys can't wear ponytails or something? How would a ponytail kink even work? Um, so if I was to explain it, when you write when you um when you wear a ponytail, like typically, like let's say you have long hair. Um, it's like it drapes down to your shoulders or past your shoulder blades or something like that, you know? When you put it into a ponytail, it exposes the neck. And um seeing extra skin around the neck, that vulnerable that vulnerable part of your body is very attractive. Don't explain it. But I know why, and I have to explain it. It's good to pull? Okay. Okay. Okay, chat. And we're not talking about ponytails anymore. I am banning it from my stream. It's banned in schools, and now it's banned in stream as well. They, But they banned because of the neck being exposed? No way. What's up with the back of the neck, though? Not the back. Um... Not the back necessarily, but the, the nape. The nape of the neck, kind of like an Attack on Titan. You know how an, an Attack on Titan, that's where you slice the Titan to, to kill them? It's like that, that's the weak spot, you know? But you just don't slice it normally. Wants to know what an apple looks like under a microscope, Gale? Um, oh shit, this is leading up to a joke. Um, <gasps> hiccup. Uh, yes, sure. So now we're talking about kinks. I mean, I guess technically if you guys want to think about it like that. I like ponytails as an aesthetic. I like as an aesthetic. I like chokers as an aesthetic. And I like thigh eyes as an aesthetic. I think they're very pretty. Like sometimes on my Twitter feed, um, I'll see like women's fashion or like gothic Lolita fashion. I'm like, wow, that's really cute. It's like nothing I would ever buy, but it's stuff that I like to appreciate from afar. And I don't think about it in like a different context. It's just simply, that is a really cute thing. And somebody would look very cute in that, you know? So the back of the neck to me is like men showing their forearm for women. Oh, is that a thing too? I don't know. I don't know what women are into. Showing off the forearm, really? Is it the veins? Is it like the veins that are attractive? I know zanny has got his uh, forearm showing with his veins, so... What's my favorite kind of sweet? And would I ever want a suggestion for any kind of sweets? And what's my favorite kind of food? My favorite sweet is strawberry cheesecake. That is, that is canon knowledge. Uh, strawberry cheesecake is my favorite. My favorite food is undecided, but it, it varies from time to time. I like all kinds of uh, meaty and starchy foods. Veins scare you? You want to pop them? Okay, that was two, two vastly different things in the same sentence. Veins make you uncomfortable. They make me uncomfortable too, but I understand like for some people it's like, oh, their blood flow's very good. They're a very healthy, like partner choice, you know? It's like a, uh, it's like if you look at veins and somebody has like large exposed veins, like you can tell they have very good cardiovascular health or something like that, you know? Who says that? Weirdos. It's not what you say, it's what you think. Uh, it's kind of like why guys like girls with big butts or white hips. Um, it's not, it's not just like that. Like it's been passed down from generation to generation that uh, wider hips are like better for childbirth and stuff like that. Unless that's been disproven, in which case I'm a liar. In which case I'm a liar. But there's also like just aesthetic things that people enjoy, which is more of a recent thing, I think. No, it's not actually. That's a lie. Don't listen to me. I'm not a, I'm not a teacher. Guys, I am not a teacher by any means. Big hands are hot. Great for grabbing basketballs and playing sports, right? You have very exposed veins, but because you're too white, all your blue veins in your hands can be seen like a jellyfish. Jellyfish. A walking, living jellyfish is in my chat right now. I'm going to bring uh, Prit back. How about that?
you want a human who is you want a partner who is into human composting and that's it good luck on your journey good luck <laughs> i don't think there's much more to say on that note other than just don't become a serial killer in the future and if, it, if you do kill anyone just don't kill me thanks You love OG fashion. So, like, that's like Prince stuff, isn't it? Oh, 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 wait. Ouija. Wait, Ouija. Is that Ouija or o OG? Like, Prince. Ouija fashion. OG. Okay, I think it's, yeah, it's autocorrecting to OG. So, I think, like, Prince. Not in a weird way, just supportive of environmental way. Yeah? Yeah, is that how it is? A sweet recommendation from Argentina you would suggest is traditional foods would be pasta frola de dolce de membrillo. A Quincy tart? But your personal favorite is alfajores. What the hell's an alfajores? Oh, that's like a... Um, it almost looks like a macaron, guys. Take a look at these. Let me, um, let me get a picture for it. I'll show it on stream. Um, image. No, no, browser source. Look at these. They look like macarons in a way. Like biscuit slash macarons. Are they filled with caramel? Is it like a caramel substance on the inside? They look delicious. I would try these. They look, they're a little powdery looking, and I don't like powdery stuff. But they look good. Looks like there's also one with coconut on it, but fuck coconut, dude. I hate coconut. All my homies hate coconut. Dolce de leche? It's um, like a pudding thing, right? Have I tried brigadeiro? Brig briga... Briga... Brigadies nuts? Uh, oh, I've seen these before. No, I've never tried them. They look too exotic for me. I like garbage food. I like food that I can eat and not feel bad about later. If I ever do eat something that looks expensive, I feel guilty about it. Which is uh, a weird thing to say. Goth too, yeah. Goth is nice as well. Guys, what are, you, what are some of your favorite kinks, everybody? Let's talk about your favorite kinks. Now that I've exposed my three of mine. No, says Vox's underwear. It's okay. Your name speaks for itself. You like smells. Your kink is taking naps. God, that turns me on so hard. When I get to nap during the middle of the day, that's so good. Uh, arms, voices, voice kink. Wow, two in a row. You don't want to know. Guys, I've seen the worst of the worst on the internet. I've been very open front with you guys. You guys got to see my vanilla right, right here in the middle of the road. It's only fair that you guys also put out. Hey, Captain, I'm exposing your pipsqueaks on Discord. They want to ask, are, am I a melon, peach, or thighs guy? Oh, that was... Oh, you're talking about, like, boobs, tits, or ass. Um, I like boobs. I like boobs. I like ass, too. And I like thighs. Um, so the answer is yes. Let me, let me go scroll back up. You guys were outing yourselves, right? Man with glasses. Oh, that's right. I was going to draw myself a glasses ass set for myself. Um, Like the... You guys remember that post that I did on Twitter for the Zodiac thing? I want to draw rimless glasses like that. Or the, like the top rimless glasses like that again. I was going to do that. I forgot to. I'll do that after stream, I think. I mean, oh, shoot. Let me write that down. Uh, never mind. I will forget about it. Your king's being called a good girl. Right, never calling that. Never saying that in chat ever again, then. I'm gonna deprive you of your, your favorite things. Whoever says breath play is you for real, for real. Is that like choking? What the fuck? Sensory deprivation, degradation. Uh, uh, what is that last one? Oh, I see. Wow. That's insane. That's insane. That's insane. That's intense and insane. sensory for you you like oh okay i see i see man you guys are very honest aren't you size kink 
Am I gonna get banned for saying kink too many times on YouTube? There's no way, right? Because, like, if somebody says kink too many times, then what about all those, like, mechanics on YouTube that are explaining, like, how to fix a kink in your armor or something like that? How to fix a kink in the valve or something like that? Praise King goes for those who come from an academic background. <laughs> oh, good job. You did really good on your test today, honey. Another 100? Wow, you're so good. Good job today. <sighs> daddy kink. What's up with daddy kink? What's up with that? By the way, mom, I hope you're watching right now. I hope you are still watching after all that, mom. After all that I've said today, after I warned you what today was going to be like, I hope you're still watching. I hope you guys are enjoying everything. How do I change my wallpaper? Let's change it to this one. Oh, no, I clicked the Patreon. Oops, not that that's a bad thing. Saying daddy wants to make you vomit physically. You saying it personally or you hearing it? Personally, I'm not the type that likes to be called daddy. I'm not a daddy guy. I'm a goofball. I'm a stupid idiot, so. Wait. I gotta scroll up again. Oh my god, I just got a text message. Please, no. That was a bluff. That was a bluff. Please stop watching. Mom, that was a bluff. Please stop watching. My mom says she's learning very much about chat today. Guys, we have to call it quits. We can't we can't keep going. <laughs> we gotta stop. I can't do this anymore. Guys, I'm retiring. Gil, Gil Galleon's gonna take on a new persona. This is, this is I regret. I regret everything today. Ugh. Instead of trauma dumping, we got kink dumping and you're here for it. Hey guys! If you guys have a mommy kink, my mom's in chat right now. You wanna say hi? I'm sure she'd love to take care of you guys. Invite you guys over for dinner and take care of you. My mom just said she, she just wanted to watch the ending of the game. Oh, mom, there's a lot more. There's a lot more to this game. Um, this is a visual novel type game, which means that um, there's typically a lot of content because um, it's very narrative driven. It's like it's like basically a visual book. By the way, thank you for texting me and not talking in chat, because that would be very embarrassing. I'm so glad to see so many people respecting my mother. <laughs> Your mother's absent and you don't need another. Hey, don't talk about my mom like that. She's wonderful. <laughs> anyway, guys, what you guys want to talk more about your kinks? Yeah? You wanna you wanna you wanna like psychoanalyze them? <laughs> You guys don't understand how much psychological damage I'm taking right now, but I'm trying to put on a brave face for you guys. I'm so sorry, Mama Gale. This is all your fault, Captain. Carla, thank you for the super chat. And yes, everyone apologize to my mom for all of your sins in chat today. Lamau. <laughs> Not in this precious, wholesome chat. I could have sworn that you were the one talking about degradation and dacrophilia or whatever the hell. <laughs> Wholesome, my ass. You don't get to say that. You like seeing people cry. That's fucked up. That was not you. That wasn't you. Oh, was that? Was, did I? Did you catch strays? My bad. I'm sorry. My short-term memory is dog shit. You were the good girl? Oh, okay. Okay, they, they, at least they added themselves. Sadistic pricks. <laughs> they don't call them a prick. Different strokes for different folks. We've all heard the phrase before. Oh, God, she's typing a message. Mom, stop! No! Whatever you're about to say, don't say anything! <laughs> oh, God. You once met a guy and he had a feet kink. You've never felt so bad in your life when he asked for feet pics. Oh! All right, guys. I'm ready for my donation. <laughs> oh. My mom said horny jail for you. Mom, you don't know what that is. You've never heard of that phrase before. Get off the internet. That's what Zanny would say. Stop watching Zanny streams. You're learning way too much forbidden knowledge. Licking your phone right now. Stop that. I'm banning you. 
put those grippers away. I mean, they're they're encased. Guys, my, my grippers are protected. They're steel-toed. Got my steel-toed boots on. Mom Galleon is chronically online. She is. She's pretty good at uh, networking online, to be honest. Can we play scale with mom? No. Nah. Is clothes kink a thing? Uh, so there's that. That's way too broad of a spectrum to delve into because there's plenty of different kinks for like fashion. So lo Gothic Lolita can be like a kink that you enjoy. Like you like seeing like lots of frills on girls and you like seeing lace and stuff like that. Um, that that could be a kink. Um, you could like the the le the amounts of clothes on a person could be correlated to a kink. But I don't I don't think clothes on a person are a kink themselves. I think you need to to, to introspect a little more to find out what your kink is. Mama Galian, I love you. Mama Galian, I love you. Says Bogsley. Mama Galian, we love you. I love you too, Mom Galian. Tell Daddy Galian that um he should not be very proud of me for today's stream. Hello. If you have a gothic Lolita kink, Lolitas will kill you heads up. Can't stop people from having it, though. Maid dresses on boys. That is... That's like a humiliation kink, isn't it? I have a dad. All right, chat. Let's talk about the birds and the bees today. So, we've got the birds... And they touch flowers, and we've got the flowers. And the birds, wait, no, it's the birds and the bees. I'm stupid, man. I can't even make a joke right. Punches myself in the face. But the bees, it was the bees, not the, not the, oh, I said the flowers, what the hell? Please stop mixing family stuff with the king stuff. This conversation sounds wrong. No, it's okay. We're not delving any, into anything weird. Don't worry. The Gale the Dad Erasure? No, my dad's here. Not here, but he's, you know. He's there with us. Somewhere in the ether. They're still stuck back at where I came from before, Avalum. Thankfully, cell phones exist. Where's the dog, brother? The dog, bro. Oh, you mean the dog, brother. Fix your commas. Know your punctuation. Oh, uh, the dog's not here. There's an, there's an empty bed behind me. Thumbs up to Papa Galleon. Yeah, I like that guy. That guy's pretty cool. He raised me to be a pretty sick dude, I would say. Hey, Mom. Mom, do you want to play Word Live with me? You want to play Word Lit? Do Pulse. Eager. No, no, no. Eagle. No, no, no. Um. E. Um. X no that's that was a bad idea my head is still blocking it oh yeah I'm an idiot you're still right guys yo please this is awkward why are you guys getting awkward why are you guys feeling awkward on my behalf I am the one who is suffering right now my <laughs> mom for your sake and for the sake of chat I'm not reading that text out loud she basically said I'm in the way, but it was phrased in such a way. All right, I'm going to read it out loud. She said your big thing is in the way. What do you mean by that, mom? She said do it. She said read it out loud. <laughs> oh, this is worse. This is worse than it could have ever been today. Um, he... No. He... No. Um, Susan, she thank you for the super chat. Thank you, thank you, Gail's mom. Your Gail's mom, your son is actually very talented and funny. Jokes aside, jokes aside, he is very sweet and goofy, and we wish him all the best going forward. I hope so. Thank you, guys. Thank you for the super chat, Susan. She. Ugh. Gotta go. Bye. Love you. Love you, mom. All right, she doesn't want to play with me. Finally, that. That lady's out of the call. Now we can finally talk about the dirty stuff again. <laughs> um, Mama Galleon, you're amazing. Mom, they think you're amazing. Don't go yet. They think you're amazing. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat. And I. Um, what could it be? C calm. C 
card car 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 uh guys i don't know this one i don't have any good ideas any suggestions for this word search for this word lit cards no, there's an e in it though carp with an e is that a word eject Ooh. Oh, okay, we got the E in the right spot. Thank you. And there's another E. Wait, no, 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 no. If there's two E's, I think it will just say that the E's in the wrong spot, isn't it? If I do E, 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 E. Yeah, it would say that all of them are in the wrong spot. Okay. Spear? No, it starts with an E. All right, so it, <laughs> we have a very low chance of getting this one, guys. We need more letters? Damn right we do. Um, Enter. No, there's no, there's only one E. Early. It was ebony. Damn. Damn. <laughs> it was ebony. Ebony, is there a Scrooge? I'm just chatting now. Just chatting is fun. But at least I have something in the background to um distract me. Um let's see. I don't have anything to talk about regarding the conversation from prior, guys. I told you guys already. I'm pretty vanilla. I just like cute and pretty girls. Subway Surfers background core. I need Subway Surfers in this game. Ebony usually refers to somebody with black hair, I think. I think so. I mean, Ebony is like a shade of black. It's also a material, yeah. It's a hardwood. It's a wood. I thought it was a metal. Or not a metal, but like a mineral. You learn something every day. You're back. What'd you miss? Uh, my mom left the chat room. She was disgraced. Not, she wasn't disgraced. She was disgusted with all of you guys talking about your dirty degradation and your wanting to be collared kinks. Do I have a go-to sport or workout when I, when I have excess energy? No, not really. Um, recently, I haven't been working out very much, if at all. Mm. The most, I, whenever I get, like, when I have an excess energy, which is usually like in the middle of the night, I want to clean. Um, my, my favorite sport is cleaning. Um, if I could go out and just like play a sport by myself, if there was like, um, if there was like an NPC on the other side of the court, I would play tennis. Cleaning zoomies are so real. Cleaning zoomies are nice because they're productive. It's a productive use of energy. The rice purity test? Yeah. Wait, no, I'm not doing that. I, I already did it. Well, I did it already, but I'm not giving you guys my score. I forgot it already anyway. I forgot what my score was. I think. I think. I never posted the results because if I gave you the entire... If you guys had the entire Avalon's rice purity test, you guys would... Uh, do things with them. His score is burnt rice. How does that even rank on the rice purity test? Oh, because it's not pure. I got you. I got you. No balls. You know how to hurt me. Did I ever play on a team? No, only casually. My parents, actually. Mama and Papa Galleon are really big into tennis. So a lot of my tennis comes from playing with them. As well as my siblings. Oh, sibling. My score is higher than Roscoe bet. Higher, like, closer to 100? Because I can tell you that much. I am not as cherry boy as Roscoe is. It is not, it is not higher than his. Is Roscoe 100? He was like 90 something, 94 or whatever. You don't get good zoomies. You just get the zoomies that make you want to spin in one spot until you can't anymore. That sounds fine. That sounds really nice too, honestly. Your parents met each other playing basketball? That's really wholesome. Your parents must be tall as hell. You have good genes? You tall? You a tall kid? Captain has committed crimes to get it lower than Roscoe. Lamau. Lost an Avalum. Yeah. I don't think he's ever done a wrong in his life. This man's never had to pray. Kai, thank you for the super chat. Gotta go to the dentist. So goodbye, Captain. And Pip Squeaks, also your mom's amazing for rising you. Thank you. I'm, a, I'm an early riser, I think. Yes. <laughs> Man. 
I, I feel like I, if I played tennis nowadays, I would be out of breath in like 15 minutes. Is it lower than Zanny's? God forbid I'm ever worse than that man. There are things that he has done. Oh, the things that he has done. What is this? Getting DMs from my C store. Either, yes, either above or below Cass and Lucy. Well, that's kind of hard because they're pretty. Uh, there's a there's a big gap between the two of them. Wait, what was Cass's? I forget mine actually. I'm not I'm not taking the testing. I forgot. But wait, no, I think I could scroll up and find it. How far? Oh my God, we talk way too much in Discord. Oh, I found it. Wow, that was easy. I did this. I took this test 10 days ago. And I was able to scroll back 10 days in Discord and successfully nail it. I'm crazy. That's insane. I am cracked. Cass is 50-ish. Was he? All right. How about this? I will give you guys my score, but... But... You're not allowed to clip it on Twitter. You're not allowed to clip it on Twitter. And also, also, if I have energy to stream later tonight, you'll come visit, okay? Wait, I don't know. Actually, I don't know if I want to stream. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I want to stream. Sorry. I don't know. I'm, in, I'm indecisive right now. I'm indecisive. Anyway, um, I'll type it on screen, okay? I'll type it on screen, but you're not. I'm serious. I will literally block you on Twitter if I see you post it. I'm like so serious. I'm, this is a betrayal of trust. This is literally just you guys are in the stream with me. This is our secret, okay? This is our secret. Satisfied? I'll post it on Twitter, Twitter when I am comfortable to. Okay. You blinked, you missed it. Damn, that sucks. That sucks, bro. That sucks, bro. You didn't see it? Y'all should have been paying attention. I give you plenty of time. Fine. All right, one more time, guys. The number's coming up in five, four, three, two, one. Did I finish my strawberries? Yes, I did. And actually they were they were lovely. Guys, I'm vi I'm vanilla as fuck. I'm very vanilla. How much of that was crime? At least 90% of it. I said, I have broken a car. I have run from the cops. I have, um, <laughs> I have fought the law. <laughs> you know, vanilla doesn't mean boring. It means basic. I never said boring. I'm basic. And don't worry. I'm quite, uh, I'm quite aware. Quite aware. I actually have a story about that. I, I have not actually run from the authorities, but um, when I was a really, really young kid and I was still, um, I was still into rollerblading, um, my sister and I had a, like a neighborhood friend, well, kind of a neighborhood friend. They were from a different neighborhood, but they visited our house one time and our parents asked us to, um, to walk them back home. And so when we were walking them back home, they lived in like a trailer park. 
when we got to the trailer park the person who owned the property for the trailer park stopped us we were really young kids probably no more than five or six at the time and we were stopped by this old crazy ass man who's yelling about something like kids keep throwing rocks in the windows of our places blah, 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 blah. and so he stops us he says don't move and so we stop because you know, we're just stupid babies um and then he calls the cops on us he calls he literally calls dials 911 to call the police on us He's like, these kids are trespassing on this property. I got, they were breaking my windows and everything. And I'm like, I'm like just sitting there. My sister's crying because she's so scared to deal with the police. And we're like, we're just trying to get our friend home. Why are you like this? That's crazy ass man. Crazy ass dude. I mean, eventually the cop was just staring at this dude like he was an idiot. And we were like, we were held there for so long. Like it was a really long time. Like I can only paraphrase, pra paraphrase it. But we were, we were gone for so long that our parents ended up driving to the neighborhood and they're like, why are you, what is going on here? And then we had to explain that we're being held hostage by this crazy ass dude. Sorry that happened to me and my sister. No, don't be sorry. It was hilarious. Guys, just because bad things happen in life doesn't mean you have to be sympathetic. Bad things happen for good reasons sometimes. They make great life stories. That's why. They make great life stories. And as long as you overcome them, you, you get past them, don't be sorry. Be happy you're here. <laughs> sorry, I can't keep myself serious. Judging by the reaction, the old man probably did it often. Probably, yeah. Did anything bad happen to the old man? Other than embarrassing himself? Nah. He got, he got to just call the cops on some children. A very normal, a very normal human reaction to have. Calling the cops on children who are rollerblading down the street. Very, very smart. Well, it's a Sag thing. It's a Sagittarius thing. Well, I getting in trouble with the cops funniest police story back in high school was two kids thought they were romeo and juliet and ran away together and were on the news missing did they call themselves romeo and juliet they they they, they must know the story right they were not a capulet and they were definitely not a dicaprio what's the other one the capulets and the montague Definitely not a Montague and a Capula. <laughs> Stupid kids. I never had to do... You know, I, I say I was a theater kid, but I've never done Romeo and Juliet as a play. I think that just... That's like a testament to the uh, the place I was raised at. They had, uh, they had standards. The only Shakespearean I did was Much Ado About Nothing. They were hella Delulu. They were on that good, good shit. That good, good shit. They had that Zaza. You knew a guy who had cops called on him when he was six because he went into someone's backyard to play with their pet rabbits. Calling the cops on somebody's kids because they were playing with pet rabbits. Just talk to the child, you... Are, uh, are, there's so many people that are incapable of dealing with situations on their own. I swear to God. They're like, I need divine intervention. Bring, bring, bring. Hello, yes, the men in blue. There's a child touching rabbits in my backyard. Yes, I want him dead. I want you to come er eliminate him. Stupid. So stupid. This is why I hate humans. Most of them can't think for themselves. Your dad was a cop and he was a school officer and was in charge of 10,000 high school kids. He managed to get in he managed to get two gangs to have peace between them. Yo, that was a good story. Oh, wait, that's happy ending. <laughs> I like happy endings. Did you still swear, think, swear as he thinks in the, he was in the right? That's like that guy that I was talking about in my neighborhood that was trying to feed our pets antifreeze. Bastard. You had someone to break into, break the fence next to your house, attempting to break in, and the fence is still broken to this day. Fix the goddamn fence! What if they come back? You know, they, they always say the culprit returns to the scene of the crime. Um, we've had many occasions where, like, storms have blown our backyard fences down and like destroyed them 
and I've had to like recruit my friends to come fix up fences. Like an entire day's project going to like a hardware store and um, rebuilding an entire fence from scratch or like repairing them. That stuff sucks, especially when it's like muddy after a storm. Treading through the mud, trying to get stuff done. Everything's wet, moist and stuff like that. You got choked by a girl in class above you because you were defending your friends in the locker room. Fun times. That reminds me, like, I was defending myself. By the way, I'm sorry that happened, which I know I just said, like, you shouldn't be sorry for things that have happened in the past because they've already happened. But that's that sounds annoying. But you're very valiant for that. I appreciate that. That sounds very good. You have a good heart. When I was really young, there was uh, there was a time I was going to uh, after after school pirate school and I was getting led to a different location by uh, like a grown up and some kid some kid walked up to me and I I was young and I had like I was still growing in like to my body and he said I had chubby cheeks. He called me chubby cheeks and then for no reason for no reason other than just me having chubby cheeks. He punches me in the face. So of course I did the only normal thing that a kid would do and I kicked him in his kneecap and I put him on the floor. Fucking little shit. I don't have chubby cheeks. I'm slim and I'm hot. Stupid idiot. Your mom got stopped by the police because you're super pale and she is super tan. So they thought you were, they thought you were getting abducted by her. <laughs> You had a child slam you into the lunch table face first because he had a crush on you? Oh, that's cute. Wait, do you still have all of your teeth? That's cute. I think you were just cute or something. <laughs> something like that, you know. Man, if I had a dollar for every time I lashed back out at somebody, I wouldn't have many, very many dollars. I wouldn't have very many dollars, but I would have a handful of dollars. I was taught by by Dad Galleon that I should never let myself get bullied. If somebody starts it, if they hit first, then, uh, you know, I have full permission to go ape shit on them. That's what I was taught. That's how I was raised. So basically, any moment that anybody ever struck back at me was just an opening. Usually they don't, though. Usually they were too pussy to start anything. Kids at your school are scared of you because you beat the entire football team in a dance-off? <laughs> Do you live in high school, the musical, the universe? That's crazy. Once you almost got expelled in high school for something you didn't do and you cried and gaslit the principal until he left the room and calls your mom to get you out. Hey, those tears are good for something. Fight tear, fight your war with tears. Uh, reminiscing is fun. This music makes me so, like, somber, too. Like, melancholic. It's the perfect Zatsudan music. Helps you reminisce. Anyway, I gotta finish these chips off, because there are still crumbs at the bottom. Ah. Hmm. <sighs> That's why cursing is your third language? Like, placing a curse on somebody? That's dangerous. Dad Galleon's right. Your mom always told you to stay quiet because you would be rich and they wouldn't. That is some short-sighted behavior. Or sorry, that's some far-sighted behavior. She had a blind spot. The trauma that you would go through if you can't fight back for yourself and defend yourself and you're just dis destined there to take it like a chump. That's bad. I don't think anyone should be forced to, uh, to take shit. I think at the very least, you should give your two cents. Don't just take a bullying. I had a good friend um, in Pirate Middle School where um, I wore a turtleneck one day and um, I had some kid making fun of me because he thought the turtle deck looked stupid and to his credit, it did. But uh, I made a friend like the same day. It was my first day in middle school and we bonded over playing Yu-Gi-Oh! and playing Mabinogi at the time, which is an MMO, an old MMO, which is still going, but we bonded over that. And that same day, he was way bigger than me, by the way. He was like half a foot bigger than me. 
he worked out he was he was stocky for like a middle schooler you you could see this guy on the side of the street and you would think this guy was a grown-ass man um but he basically shoved that kid aside and put him in his place for me it's kind of like i had my own bodyguard it was super sick i'm still friends with him by the way i'm actually um i'm gonna be seeing him very soon i'll be seeing him during my trip over the weekend he suck he's up he suck he's uh he's fucking awesome i love that guy me and him talk on a uh, well not on a daily basis but you know we're still very good friends friends for life kind of deal that's been over 10 years now over a decade shit You'll make sure to be here years later when you're a proper psychologist. Hire me, Pipsqueaks. You never notice when people bullied you because you're autistic, hee <laughs> hee, built-in shield. Hey, perfect. It's a, it's like a free defense mechanism. It's like having, um... Oh, it's like a... Oh, shoot. I don't remember what anime it is, but it's like... It's like having a, like a force field around you that blocks incoming damage automatically. That's crazy. In middle school, your friend was getting bullied because of her appearance. So you told the bully to look at themselves in the mirror first, but they would break it. Let me out. That's a good one. That's a good one. Mob Psycho? Yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mob Psycho. That's the one. That's exactly what I was thinking of. It was like Mob Psycho. <laughs> Were they going to do unautism you? I'd like to see them try. Man, it's been fun talking. I yapped. I freaking yapped today, didn't I? So like Violet in the Incredibles? Violet? She had to like manually do it though. This kind of uh this kind of force field is like it's like a background process on your computer. Been a while since we had a proper Zatsu. Should have labeled this entire stream as a Zatsu, shouldn't I have? Ugh. <sighs> I think I'm dried up now, though. I think I'm drying up now. It's almost been three hours. It's probably one of my shortest streams yet, right? Let me double check. I really do have like a battery on my Zatsus. Let's see. Oh, Lethal Company was actually shorter than this. Oof, I want to play Lethal Company so bad. If I play a game tonight, I'm going to play Lethal Company. If I, if I, per chance, if I do, I'll announce it on Twitter. I'll set up a waiting room. If I do play a game, it's going to be Lethal Company. I want to solo it. I want to get better at soloing Lethal Company. The shortest one was like 40-ish minutes. Oh, but I unlisted that one. I don't count that one because that was like, that was a part of the Raft collab. Oh, the, the Grim Fairy Tale stream was an hour and 43 minutes. And the Fall Guys. And the, there was a Hades one too. Okay, never mind. And <laughs> okay, this one doesn't count. The 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 every time I I curse, I take a shot Minecraft stream. That one doesn't count, right? Oh my god, I've had so many streams after that. Wait, 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 and today is 13. There's been 13 streams since the drunk Minecraft. You still need to watch that vod? Please don't for my sake. Please don't. That was so embarrassing. Although I was actually, you know, surprisingly, that stream of all the streams that I've done did not get ad limited because of my cursing, which I, I would assume is because I was refraining from doing so, which I, th I, th I just think it's funny. I just think that's pretty funny. Thank you for the super chat. Nice. Don't feel bad, Captain. We appreciate you either way. Do whatever you are comfortable. Thank you. Do whatever you're comf comfy with. That's why I didn't continue with a day with death today, because I was just a little, I just wasn't feeling it. I think I need more breath training. If you had to, if I had to live by any particular mantra, what would it be? Why is my eyes? Why, why do I have a lazy eye? Hello? <laughs> uh, if, uh, I don't know any mantras, honestly. I live by the pirate code. <laughs> I do what I want. I live, I live my life doing what I want with my crew. I lead the crew and I work for them because they work for me. But I do what I want and they're with me. 
I don't know. Is that a monstro? Probably not, but that's my... That's my prime directive. I look like that emote for a second. I can't even do it. I can't do it on my own. I can't do it anymore. I talk about balls every five minutes and I do what I want. Hey, I've been pretty good today. To be fair, I've been doing pretty damn good during this stream. <laughs> Wait, I saw that chat that said, I think you'd be a great VTuber. And for a second there, I thought it was um, at me. I'm like, thanks. <laughs> thanks. I think, I think I'd be a pretty good VTuber too. Appreciate it. <laughs> uh, it's not like I've been striving to be one for a while now. Because Mama Galleon was here, wasn't it? No, she's been gone for a while now. I've been pretty good about not talking about balls. Can I put my balls in your jaws? Can I put my balls in your jaws? Can I put my balls in your jaws? I should totally debut. I would do great. Thanks. I think I'll debut next week. I got the model and rigging ready already, so. And a bird. I got a bird too. What should I do? What should you do if you see a clip of the score on YouTube? Should you block on YouTube? You mean Twitter? Um, no, don't do anything. It's not your guys' job to to fight my battles. I don't want anybody out there. Nobody. Nobody. Not a single pipsqueak, not a single avalite should be fighting our battles for us. If there's something that really demands our attention, like we're all adults. We'll get to it. Um, if it's something that I truly think is something that's bad. I'll talk to them myself. To whoever it is. To whoever it may be. What? Well, you wait, wait, you missed it? What happened? Literally nothing. Nothing happened. Somebody was asking if somebody posts the score on Twitter, what would happen? Um, do they, do I want them, do I want you guys to do anything? No, I don't want you guys to do a single thing. Like, you can comment. You're allowed to comment. I'm not going to stop you from doing it if you guys want to be like, hey, he said not to do that. But... It's not your it's not your fight. Don't worry. I want you guys to focus on just being happy. If seeing that makes you unhappy, then let them know. Make a comment, leave a comment or something like that. Say, hey, you weren't supposed to do that. But don't speak on my behalf. Never speak on my behalf. I'm a grown ass dude. And I respect you guys enough to uh to not overstep any boundaries. And I trust you guys. So keep it like that. Thank you for saying that, of course. I truly believe that you guys are not stupid. I think that my chat are some of the smarter chats. Uh, you guys are one of the smarter, like, chats out there. Um, you guys have a very high EQ and a very high IQ as well. Um, I truly believe that. I think you guys are not stupid. You guys don't just come in here speaking random garbage all the time. You guys aren't trying to constantly distract me with different topics unless we're doing Zatsu like this. Um, you guys are normally, like, very on point with your, with your behavior. So, I have nothing to say, except for good things about you guys. But, um, if you guys have a degradation kink, then, um, you guys are disgusting, filthy, talking about your kinks in chat. <laughs> Get out of here. I don't want to see you ever again. But for all the good girls and boys, yeah, I like you guys. You guys are cool. No, you like praise? I gave you the praise already. Slurps, you stop that. Spits back, <laughs> spits your spit back. The sudden change. Don't forget, my brand is Whiplash. Yippee, me a good boy. <laughs> Yippee! <laughs> Yippee! What if you're into that? I can't stop you. Spits your and their spit back. How'd you catch that? <clears throat> Do you guys think? No, never mind. Actually, no. This is not information that I should be asking you guys. It's nothing bad or weird. It was just like, I should not be saying things to influence your guys' votes. Uh, vote for me, by the way, for Captain Pirates President. say it no it, it was really nothing like it was like it was like what do you guys think about this do you guys think we should x you know it was like 
It was basically where I would get a unanimous applause of, yes, you should, you should. But um, I want to make sure that I do things on my own accord. So I don't want to be influenced by you guys. I want to do the things that I like to do. Like occasionally I'll get your guys' opinion for stuff, but for the most part, I'll do things that I want to do. I'm already president in your hearts. Aww. All right, my first uh, my first legislation is that um, all bad boys and bad girls um, go underneath the deck for reparations. And all the good pipsqueaks can stay up top and work. Yeah. Guys, I'm actually just locking all the bad ones down there. I'm not going down there ever. Repercussions? Yeah, I meant repercussions, but um, if I switch, if I fixed my uh, word as I said it, I would have sounded less intimidating. That's not what reparations are. Yeah, I know I'm stupid. Would I ever do NPC streams? Is every stream that I do not an NPC stream? I feel like I'm on autopilot for the most part. MBTI? Um, I'm the adventurer type, whatever that is. I forget. Uh, I, uh, I forget what the adventurer type is. Let me Google it again. Like, I'm, I'm literally the adventurer type. Is uh, ISFP. Okay, I was right. ISFP, yeah. Do people still do NPC streams? Uh... No? Yes? Maybe? I saw one TikTok going around on Twitter where somebody got... Some guy was like... He had like a, a, a water balloon over his head that was filling up. And he's like... Please, please, please. He's like panicking because it's about to break. What's an NPC stream? It's if I was to do this. Thanks for the rose. Mmm, smells so good. Thanks for the glizzy. Wow, rose. Mmm, smells so good. Insane bullshit like that. So, like, robotic? NPC stream is to equate to, like, you know, like in a video game, there are characters that you can talk to, but they don't really say anything different. They like, if you talk to a character in a video game, they usually have like dialogue that if you keep, if you keep talking to them, it's the same stuff over and over. That's basically the gist of it. I need more bullets. Brrr. I need more bullets. Brrr. You know, that was supposed to be for my ass, but I just realized the implications that that, that that just brought upon. Oops. Well, can't take that back. Veggie jump scare. Blah! Thanks for the veggies. Blah! Aaron Light, hello. Thank you for the super chat. A bit late, but you finally managed to catch part of the stream on break for work. Congrats on 20k cast, and here's the many more. Thank you. I have finally done it. I've made it to 20k. And you know what that means? Only 80 left. I was behaving so well. It was an accident. It was an accident, guys. You thought I met my sword? Nope. It was for my ass. I need my bullet. Man, 20k doesn't feel real. Like three months ago, I wouldn't have imagined being here already. Like, this is ridiculous. Um. Again, this is why I have to reiterate, like, how uh, uh, grateful I am for you guys. That's it. I'm not going to get sappy again. I've been sappy too many times already today. Soon it'll be 50k? Yeah, by tomorrow, right? I assume you have the alt accounts ready, primed, and ready to sub, right? Do I want to know a, fact, a fun fact about ginkgo trees? They can't be found in the wild because there are girl trees and boy trees, so they can't mate easily. They can't be found in the wild because there are girl trees and boy trees, 
so they can't mate easily. Hmm? Hmm? Is if it, uh, it, it, I read it like a joke because of the leaves. Googling this, ginkgo tree mating. What? The leaves can't spread far. Oh, like on the same tree. Wait. Uh, wait. There are only there are male and female only trees. That's how trees grow. Oh, the leaves spread. <gasps> wait. I feel like an NPC now. I don't think I get it. Like, I've, you've given me an explanation, and yet, I think I'm literally too stupid now. Oh no! There's this old plant, and it's the last of its kind because all the females of that plant died, so it's kind of sad looking. You know, literally the last unicorn kind of situation, huh? It's the flower slash pollen. Some trees can only produce flowers, and some can only produce pollen. But, so the, so the boys and the girl trees are not close by? In interest, I, 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 Gale search history. Alpha Horeas, Brigadiera, Ginkgo trees mating. How did you know I Google that exactly? Probably because I said it out loud, right? Muddy trees have genders. Oh, uh, I don't know. It's kind of hard to explain, but trees have male and female parts normally. Oh! 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 That's what you mean. Trees typically have both, both, like, facilities to, um, produce. Like, they can have pollen to, to, um, not pollen, but, like, they have nuts, and the nuts can be fertilized. I get it now, but ginkgo trees, if they're in the wild, it's not guaranteed that they could be, that all ginkgo trees are gonna be, like, born next to male or female trees. Oh! That makes sense. I was like, don't trees normally have two? Like, aren't they normally male and female? POV, you're an aspiring biologist and you blow a pirate's mind? <laughs> Consider my scally wagged. That's crazy. I, um, I didn't like any classes in school. I, like, barely treaded 70s, like, passing, I barely treaded, treaded passing grades in school. I think the only class that I ever did decent at was, um, science, I think, barely, but it was, like, it wasn't, like, super duper hard science. It was, like, what is, what is the three states of matter? Stuff like that, you know? Stupid stuff like that. Night, what the hell? You're going crazy today. Thank you for the super chat. Just casually dropping this here. Thank you for being such a great entertainer. Whether you show off your gaming skills or just yap, it's always so fun to watch you. I am happy to have found you in Avalon and you fell into this rabbit hole. Oh, that's right. Yeah, they, um... Night was not a VTuber fan beforehand. They got sucked in because of us. Get fricked. Oh my god, the dogs. Sorry, I pogged. Yeah, thank you very much, Knight. I really do appreciate it. I'm glad that there's a lot of people to see a lot of people have gotten into VTubers because of Avalum, of all things. Like, VTubers have been around for years now. But we were the straw that broke the camel's back. That's, that's badass. Your grades depend if you like your depend on if you like your teachers. Sometimes it depends on if they like you, too. You're the same MBTI as me? Hey! I am, I'm just saying. Chat reflects the streamer. Happens every time. 
Look at you being cool and funny and pulling people to the dark side. Hey, what can I say? That's what I do best. Waterboarding them and then brainwashing them into thinking VTubers are cool. Yeah. I brought a breath of fresh air into the VTuber scene. And that's, you say that someone has watched VTubers for a while. That's not true. I don't, I can't, I can't say that. I can't, I can't believe that personally. But that's probably a confidence thing. But I can't say for certain on my own if we're unique yet. Okay, now it sounds like I'm fishing for compliments. I sound like a, uh, sound like I'm begging for attention. Oops. Oh, shit. Oh, God damn it. Here it comes. Okay. Whew. Okay. In your opinions like that, you were losing interest and BAM! We appeared and ignited your interest. That's awesome. That's very, very wholesome to hear. I don't... No. What being different in the VTuber sphere even means. I just, I just do me, you know? Like, like I said, my pirate code is literally just do what I want. Um, my will changes from day to day. My passions shift every now and again. So, I guess it's spicy, right? Streams are spicy. By the way, if you guys are liking the stream, make sure to hit that like button below the video. And if you haven't subscribed already, check below. Make sure you're not. Most, you know, 10% of my viewers don't realize that they're not subscribed. Uh, make sure to hit that bell, get notifications every time I go live. And sure to comment below and push me in the algorithm. Damn, you boost up your confidence, Captain. No, I don't want to have a high confidence. Thank you, May Adamara, for the super chat. Damn it. Stop giving me money. It's not going to make me feel better. It does make me feel a little better. Thank you. <laughs> It makes me very happy to see you guys supporting me so much. Skip that. No, 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 no. Don't skip that. You're very close to leaving the VTuber scene, a VTuber scene, but then one random night got an ad for the one only Roscoe. Sorry to hear about that. You should have dodged when you had the chance. Should have skipped ad. Being humble is good. Yeah, well, like, listen. I need to be humble because this fat head, this hat is hiding an enormous ego underneath it. It's a very difficult tight roping act that I'm doing here. I'm going to need y'all to listen up. This stream's looking better than I am. And that's saying something. All work and no play. That's boring. Ugh. AO3 brought you here? You're fucking kidding, right? Wait. Which one? I haven't read any of them yet. Nice. Thank you for the super chat. Thank you. Thank you. It is because you are you. You don't have to super chat. You can... You don't have to super chat. If you read... If you have a heartfelt message, I'll usually get it in chat. Thank you, though. You're a goofball, but at the same time, so real. Which IMO stands out a lot more. Come on. You can have a little ego boost. As a snack. Yeah, which AO3 was it? I'm gonna read it. AO3 Avalon. Gail, don't read them. You're scared? Why? Did you write them? How do I get here? Let me look for the Gail Galleon ones. This is torture, isn't it? This is torture for everybody who, who actually goes on AO3. Ooh, I'm excited. It's okay, guys. I don't think he can read. Shut up! I can read 40% of the time. Okay, I'll just read the tags. Does that make you guys feel better? At least look at the tags. Yeah, I'll, I'll just read the tags. I won't read them. Don't pick a smutty one, okay? Why not? We're already this far into the stream. What's going to happen, huh? Gale reading with, with reading glasses? Oof. I need glasses and assets so bad. Your charm is your authentic self, Captain. That is what made me, me follow the pre-debut. That was a menace, an ex formerly known as Twitter. Listen, if I'm not myself, literally, who am I? I'm not... I'm an actor, but I'm not a pretender. You know? I'm an actor, not a pretender. I can't be anybody but myself, which is, you know, probably explains a lot. All right. Let's see. Which one's... Okay, here we go. That's a lot of tags. 
This one's called... Oh, no, actually, no. I won't read the title. I'll just read the text. Hey, little buddy. Hi. Hi, buddy. Hi. You want to come up? I'll bring the pup up. I'll bring pup up. And he can read the tags with me. I think you're old enough to read AO3 tags with me now, buddy. Okay. Oh, he's so happy to be up here. <laughs> hey, buddy. You smell like pee again. Did you pee yourself? No, don't corrupt the pup. He's fine. He'll be fine. Hi. <laughs> he keeps looking back at me. Hi. <laughs> he's so cute. You want, you want to say anything? You want to say anything? Oh, he's licking me. He's licking me with the mouth that has licked poop and ate poop today. I don't think he has anything to say. Oh, you want paw? Good boy. Good boy. Good paw. Good paw. Oh, he's licking my hands with his poop ridden mouth. Oh, he's so cute. I'm gonna have to shower after this. Hi, buddy. Oh, he's so cute. He's so cute. Oh, I love you. Hi. I wish you could speak on command. Hey, wait, your diaper's getting loose again. Oh, God. Buddy, why are you doing this to me? Come on. God, hey, let me fix this. Wait, why, why does this keep coming undone? Probably because I'm a terrible father. I can't do anything right. Oh. Wait, sit up. Sit up. 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 Okay, this way. Let's go this way. Please, stay on this time. Oh, that's the Velcro. Oh, oh, I've been doing it wrong this whole time. There you go. I fixed you up. Here, you thought Gail was a cat guy? No, I'm a dog guy through and through. I love dogs. I missed the Velcro on it though. Let me out. Let me out. Oh, we think I'm a cat guy because I say let me out all the time. I get it now. Dad is struggling. You understand why my sleep has been deprived recently because I suck at my job. Have I, have I ever changed a diaper <laughs> with this guy? Yeah, way more, may, way more than I needed to. Anyway, uh, okay, so this is tags. Gail Galleon slash Cassian Floros. Xander Netherbrand slash Cassian Floros. Xander Netherbrand slash Gail Galleon. Cassian Floros slash Gail Galleon slash Xander Netherbrand. Cassian Floros. Gail Galleon. Xander Netherbrand. Top Gail Galleon. Top, Xander, Xander Netherbrand. Bottom, Cassian Floros. Polly Amory. Characters playing Monopoly, the board game. What the fuck is that detour? Oh my god. I thought I was the king of Whiplash until this AO3 fanfic came out. What the fuck is Monopoly doing in my AO3? Oh, characters playing Monopoly, board game. Next tag, but it takes a turn. Next tag. Smut. Banter. Plot? What plot? Slash porn without plot. Blowjobs. DP. Cassian takes it like a champ. Zanny uses his incubus powers. Deep throating. Not beta red. Succubi and incubi. Love bites. Self, indul self indulgent. Unrealistic sex. The only thing, yeah, yeah. The only time that, okay, hang on a second, hang on a second. Like, there's a joke here. Let me rephrase. Yeah, unrealistic sex because Avalon having sex is a far cry. Ah? Oh no. I'm sorry, what did I walk into? Oh. We're playing a date with death. Yeah, we're just playing a date with death. See? See? Just playing a date with death. Nah, I'm just kidding. We're talking about fanfics. Reading tags. Let me read, let me leave this music on, actually. I like the music. Cast top, not fanfic writers say he's a bottom. Dude, yeah. I think most of them say cast bottom. Even though he, like... He did the BDSM results, and he was pretty aggressive, wasn't he? Wasn't he? He was pretty aggressive. And also, for the test, the Omegaverse, he got alpha. Alright, let's read another set of tags. Oh my god. Okay, Xander to the brand, Gale Galleon. Okay, it's, it's all of Avalum. Avalum, plot, alternate universe, slow burn, weird plot shit. Xander is pretty. That's a nice tag. Roscoe is short. That's a better tag. And yes, you read that right. Cassian X Tree. Next tag. I'm sorry. Next tag. He's an elf. 
Next tag. I thought it was funny. Next tag. Don't worry, there's no smut. Oh, can I read this one? How do I read this? How do I get to it? Cast X tree. Oh! This is for Raft, the video game. It's an alternate universe if we're in Raft. Wait, I want to read this now. Oh, I shouldn't read it without their permission, though. Cast is a tree hugger. He's a tree humper, more like. All right, I'll, I'll get off the AO3. I think it's enough torturing you guys. Click the title. I tried and I didn't see anything below. Never mind. I already, I already got, off, got off of it. It's okay. They're not sorry. <laughs> they're not sorry. No, there's no way they're sorry. We're almost 20k on Twitter also. When I was um pre-debut, I wanted it to be my life's goal to make sure that my YouTube subscribers never was underneath my Twitter followers. Because if that happens, if my Twitter was better than my YouTube, I would be so sad. Because like, real talk, I don't care how big my Twitter gets. All I care about is posting shit posts. All I what I really care about is posting shit posts on on Twitter and then my YouTube blowing up. That's all I care about. I don't I don't care how big it gets. I've already got you guys on there so it doesn't need to get bigger. I mean of course I'll still I'll still uh still post stuff, shit posts and stuff like that and if people follow that's cool, but I am not doing it with the intention of blowing it up. I I I'll leave that behind. That's fine. My tweets are bangers though. Wait, let me read it out loud. You know, the one tweet. Hi, hey, buddy. Yeah, put your head down. There you go. He's got my hand hostage. Wait, Dave Death. Where's my one tweet? The one tweet that I love. The funny one. No lights. No bed bugs. All night and day. From the living room to the bedroom. From the office chair to the sheets. While I yawn for air and me, 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 the snores there. Sheets can top me. That shit was so funny. You still have no idea what I meant? Oh. I mean, there's source. There's source material. Do you really want to know? I'm surprised more people didn't know it. It was the... No lube, no protection, all night, all day. From the kitchen floor to the toilet seat, from the dining table to the bedroom, from the bathroom sink to the shower, from the front porch to the balcony, vertically, horizontally, quadratic, exponent AI, logarith 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 logarithmic, while I gasp for air, scream and see the light, missionary, etc., etc. Stop licking me with your poop ridden hands. You're biting me now, bastard. Stay quiet, the people must know. I really have to wash this hand afterwards. Disgusting. Am I talking about pouncing the barrel? What does that mean? Pouncing the barrel. Irie, thank you for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Just letting you know, my friend pinged you on uh, pinged you on Discord. Your friend pinged you on Discord and told me, Irie, get your Hoshi. He's insane after seeing that tweet. This shit was so funny. It was so funny. It was so funny. People have been doing those in different languages on Twitter, so when you hit translate, you're traumatized. Oh, God. Wash his teethies. Yeah, he needs to get unpoopified. By the way, I'm still letting him lick my hand. I'll just wash my hands afterwards. I'm going to shower and clean my clothes because this is disgusting, but I don't want to deny him the pleasure. It was a banger. I know. <laughs> What is such a funny place? We have different definitions of funny. What is what is that? LH? Lighthearted? We have different definitions of funny. Yeah, we do. And I think that's totally okay. I think if everybody thought the same thing was funny, people like me couldn't exist. Right? People like me could not exist. Stop licking me! Thanks. I thought it was pretty funny. Oh my god, new art. There's so much new art. I gotta go look at my art tag again today. You guys are fantastic artists. I'm so fucking serious. You thought it was funny, but you told I told you to pretend that it was you who said it? Yeah. I said, oh, I meant, I meant for you to not quote retweet it. You were supposed to literally copy and paste it. You were supposed to copy and paste it and tweet it on your own. 
the no you love the no lube no protection copy boss it's it's pretty fucking funny it's pretty fucking funny i think it's even better when there's renditions of it evolution wasn't born in a day slowly but surely someone else out there is going to be doing a no bed sheets or no a bed sheets can top me post but like with different words Want you to repost the one where I drew you shirtless? Huh? No, I don't want to see myself shirtless. <laughs> Hazukashi. That's Hazukashi. Should I just sit here all day with you guys? Is there something else? Is there somewhere else you can post art if you don't have Twitter? There's the Avalon Discord, but you'd have to ask somebody in chat to give you a link to it because I'm not in it. There's an Avalum Discord and there's a Gale Discord. If you're interested in joining those, if you don't want to join Av the Avalum Discord and you don't want to join on Twitter, um, I don't think at the moment there's any other way to contact us. Y'all, the Discord link, please. Um, if if a mod in chat is here, are you guys in the Avalum Discord? And if so. Would you be able to provide a link for them? And you could post it in chat. Please. One moment. Thank you. Appreciate it. Um, just a, you know, just a content warning. Avalum does not condone. No, I'm sorry, not condone, but is not responsible for any of the, the things that happen inside the, the Discord. We have no idea what goes on in there. So just, uh, just know that we have no affiliation with it whatsoever. Imagine Gail joining. Don't make me. Don't make me do it. I won't, by the way. I'm actually not going to. The Avalon Court is specifically for you guys, not us. Um, it's for you guys to become degenerates. And um, it's also for me to pry open when I'm on Twitter at 2 in the morning. And I want to say, and I want to see what you guys are posting. And I tell you guys to betray each other. Thank you, Coco Go, for the, uh, the link to the Discord. Not official or affiliated, exactly. Not even slightly. The only thing we have... Related to that is that it uses our names. But um, as far as I'm aware, the mods in that Discord are pretty chill. They're pretty nice. Everyone's very friendly and welcoming. So if you guys are looking for a place to stay, feel free to go there. But again, I do not condone any of that. Did I just get an advertisement sent my way? I got texted an advertisement for puppies. They want me to adopt more puppies. I literally got a text just now. I'm, I'm not even joking. I got a text just now saying, puppy arrival. I'm like, yeah, the puppy's right here in my hands right now. I'm, I've already got one. Thank you. Give them to you? No, you would like to watch them decompose and like fertilize a tree or something like that. Get a puppy for our puppy. Chat, our puppy is fine by himself. Hey, no, it's my water. Good boy. Is it a wrong number text? It's just, it's just, uh, you know, you know how everybody's phone number has been leaked to the freaking, to the deep web. Everybody has your phone number now. Puppy's going to be depressed by himself. He's right, he's right here with me. He's with me. He's with me. He's a daddy's boy. He's such a daddy's boy. Sleeps on my feet every night. It pisses me off because I can't get sleep because of him. You already get too many calls, don't make you paranoid. I mean, no, I mean, I literally get spam calls every day. If your phone number hasn't been leaked already, you're doing something right. <laughs> I want your strategies. I should switch my phone number, maybe. I think it costs money to do that, though. It's so annoying to do that, though. I love you, little buddy. You're so funny. He's such a chill dog. Until he's not. Gotta take care. Hey, have a good day. Yeah, feel free feel free to post all the um all the stuff you do in the Discord. Everyone's very friendly there. I am aware of that at least. I'm still streaming? Barely. No, not even, not barely. I'm uh I'm just vibing. I stopped playing Date with Death like Death a uh, date with death like an hour ago, I think. We've been Zatsuing for an hour. Ish. I think people are calling for you and asking for your for a debt because of your father. 
What the fuck? That's scary. Um, just keep ignoring them, and then eventually it'll go away, right? Good enough work. Hey, take care. All right, I think it's um, that's probably a fine time to close up the stream, honestly. Just don't pick up. Yep, basically. I had I had deny on every number I don't know. Are deck rules set at the start, or do they evolve over time? Talking about the stream rules, they evolve over time. Um, if something pisses me off, I'll uh, make a new rule for it. So far, the only real rule um, that I actively enforce is the do not roleplay with me, because that's freaking weird. Don't roleplay with me in my chat. And secondarily, like, don't backseat me. But there's a lot of... Th but, like, the backseating one's, like, kind of, like... That one's a little bit iffy, because... If, if somebody backseats me and it's good advice, I won't punish them, so... Lamau. Locked in after ignoring call. I've done that to too many numbers, and they don't stop coming. They don't stop coming. And 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 they don't stop coming. They don't stop coming. Role playing in chat is so weird. There is a market for it, but I don't think I'm that parasocial with you guys. <laughs> I'm not that parasocial with you guys. I'm not going to role play. Well, I'll role play myself, but nobody should be reciprocating it because it's weird enough when I do it. You know? Today's your birthday? Why didn't you say so sooner? Or maybe you did and I missed it. I'm so sorry. You're embarrassed to ask for a happy birthday, but here you are. No, shut up. You deserve it. Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you for making it another year. Everyone, you ready? Hat. Hey, I'm back. Was that fucked up? Was that pretty fucked up? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear. Wait, I missed your name. Wait, your name was long. I forgot it. Happy birthday, dear Tiny Azzy Charm. Happy birthday to you. Dies. I know I should end stream right now, but there's a part of me that just doesn't want to leave. You're gonna cry? Yeah, cry! Cry! Cry because you're so happy! Make sure to breathe. No, fuck you. I don't want to breathe anymore. <gasps>
I made it to the end of the song. I could have gone go. I could have uh, kept going too. My breath holding is good, but my my note holding is bad. Ooh, you should do the you should the pip themed bag. Ooh. <gasps> I'm not as good at holding notes. My breath control is really bad. That's why I'm still struggling to sing. But you know, it's not the worst. What is this stream? It's whatever, honestly. I played a date with death today. It was a date with death stream. This is the post stream now for the past like hour and a half or whatever. Wait, my breath feels like really breathy now after after holding my breath. I keep cracking at the low notes. <clears throat> Probably because I was holding notes and my winds my windpipes are oh, they need to be wetted, but I have no water left. <clears throat> Mm -hmm. no, I can't go. I can't go that low. Mm -hmm. oh, two sides of the story, but they never tell my. Oh, he finally does a Zatsu, and I can't be here throwing hands. Sorry, sorry. Have I been drinking water? I have been drinking water. Yeah, I ran out though. I ran out of water. I've got puppy on my lap too. You guys wouldn't want me to disturb the puppy, right? My, um, I'm not very good at switching to falsetto either. It's very difficult for me. It's very sudden and jarring. I got to stay dehydrated. Oh, man. All right, puppy, you heard it. You're more important than my livelihood. Vocal fry king. You know, I was going to end stream, but I, I'm going to keep going for a little longer. Because you guys have given me new things to talk about. Uh, yeah, I... I mean, I've definitely damaged my vocal cords. Probably because, like, I've drunk soda a lot of my life. I, I, I don't know what the... I don't know what the cause is. I'm not a doctor, guys. But if I was going to place any bets, it's probably not a natural thing. It's probably that I've drinking so much carbonated beverages and stuff like that. So I've got a very, uh... I've got a very gravelly voice. If you guys want to know, this is, um... If this is me talking in a low tone... Um, very bassy type. It, it, it just cracks on its own, you know. Imagine hitting the notes around my forehead. Oh, oh I'm not doing vol. I can't do it. No. I'm too embarrassed right now. I'll do it. I'll do it off stream, though. You should stop drinking so much soda then. Hey, you need a, you need a healthy balance. Um, when I drink soda, I would drink just soda. Um. And I wouldn't. Okay, I'm not a doctor, guys. It's not. This is not advice. This is what I presume for my own case. But I would drink a lot of soda without water, and so the the sugars inside of the soda would um, probably. I think they probably are to blame for damaging my throat, but I'm not sure. Alcohol, milk, and caffeine can mess up your voice. When you're in choir, you are banned from milk before competitions. Oh yeah, that's for sure. <laughs> Don't do it now. Yeah, I'm embarrassed too. You have a problem with using your diaphragm for breathing, so singing can be painful. Oh, okay, I see. That sucks because your diaphragm is super important for singing. You had to stop drinking water because you used to drink so much. You were getting migraines. That's a thing. I guess maybe you're flushing out vitamins in your body. This is conjecture, by the way. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Just a theory. A gaming theory. Water and vegetable diet from now on. Hell to the no! Hell to the no! Fuck that! That sounds like shit! My head voice is kind of there. 
My head voice is kind of there. They're like, this is my, this is my head voice. Me talking normally on stream is my head voice. This is my natural state of talking. Um, when I try to like emphasize it a little bit more, this is me talking like with my stomach. And this is me talking with my, my, um, my falsetto. And it sounds really freaking, um, what's the word? <laughs> Bottom? <laughs> Need to eat my vegetables? Nope. No. What kind of puppy do I have? You've asked that before. Um, like I've said, I'm not going to be giving you guys the breed of dog that I have. Um, he's going to remain anonymous. His name is Pup, and he can fit on my lap. That's as much information as a little pup that I'm giving out. It sounds like I'm pretending to be nice. I'm not pretending to be nice. I love you guys so much. You guys are literally the light of my life. I look forward to seeing you guys every day that I stream. Pup the mystery dog is a gacha dog. You can be whatever you want him to be. If you guys want to draw a pup, I'll hype up. <laughs> um, if you need to know, pup, pup's head can fit into my hand. And he fits on my lap. That's as much detail as you get. He's a chihuahua now. You're a chihuahua. You're a little, you're a little chihuahua. Do you want to be a chihuahua? Do you want to be a loud little rat? You talk low for being a female, but when you, um, when you're around people, you raise your voice without wanting to, you hate it. Um, if I was going to guess, it's because, um, that's like a social thing. Most people raise their voices when they're talking to people. Like, I'm talking to you guys casually because I basically see you guys as like an extension of myself. Um, so I'm, I'm totally comfortable talking to you guys, but a lot of people in public will... They'll raise their voice to show that they don't mean any harm, you know? If I'm talking to you like this, um, it's sort of, you sort of assume like I don't have any malintent. But if I'm talking to you like this, there's a lot of nuance that can be transferred through the way that I speak. Um, less so when you, when you have your voice constantly like this. There's only one nuance you can really take and that's your energetic. It's, um, it's another defense mechanism to keep, your safe, to keep yourself safe in public. You don't want people to misunderstand what you're doing. It's not a weird thing to do. It's not a weird thing to do at all. I do it too. Like if I talk to you in public and I don't know you, um, I'll be talking like this. Yeah, sure. I could do that. Yeah, that sounds good. But um, if I do know you, uh, I'll, I'll just talk to you like the shithead that I am. It's definitely the audience that you give yourself that determines what voice you put on for people. And this is my most authentic voice that I can give you guys. So, just take that for what it is. Hope you guys have learned something today. It's a subconscious thing to make people like you. Yeah, I mean, more or less. Make them like you is not exactly the right way of putting it, but it's like, um, it's sort of like waving a white flag. Like, you don't have to say anything, but if you wave the white flag, people know that you're friendly. It's like that. You yelled so much when you were younger, your throat is ruined forever. I used to get slapped. Not literally, but like... Gail Mama would, um... Would, would, be, would be on my case every time I got loud. She'd be like, Shut up, you're too loud! <laughs> now look at me, Mom. I can be loud and I can make money doing it. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that crazy? Can people at work stop interrupting my official pipsqueak business, please? You've got a you've got a obligation to your real life. Sorry about that. NPC voice for strangers. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. Take that, mama. If she could hear me now, she would be texting me in two seconds. Your voice becomes higher when you speak English and it feels so weird. Is English not your first language? It could be because that you're not um, comfortable speaking English. I don't know. I'm just guessing. Are you not comfortable speaking English? Or do you want to, like, make sure that your English doesn't come off with a bad intention? Language can also change the voice, yeah. I think, um, when, when I talk in Japanese, um, like, out loud, my voice gets tired too, because I'm very unconfident in my intonations. Your voice gets lower when you speak in Japanese, so maybe it's just how you learn it. 
Did you watch a lot of JoJo? Or did you learn your Japanese from playing the Yakuza series? Ora, to me. Koitsuga. My, my Japanese is totemo umai. Umai desu ne. Umai. You try to enunciate a lot of the words so it does affect it. Ah, that could be it too, yeah. It's cool. I think the voice is such a cool organ. It's not an organ, obviously, but... It's, um... It's such a neat... It's such an interesting tool. I mean, that's why I got into uh, voice acting and doing stage, doing stage work in the first place. So I like using my voice. Even though at a, there was a time before where I would listen back on myself and literally hate my voice, which is very common. If you hear your voice played back to you, you're like, who is this person? Who are you? I don't know you, you're, you sound stupid. But the more you listen to yourself, the more you sort of accept, like that's just who you are and the uh, more comfortable you can be with um, yourself. I think it's a good exercise is um, listening to like a playback of yourself is a good way to gain confidence. It's gonna suck in the beginning though. It's gonna suck. You're gonna be in the pits. You're gonna be in the trenches. But um, I can sit through an entire VOD of my own and enjoy it at the same time. I was actually watching my Overwatch VOD, not last night. I think it was the night before. I was re-watching my Overwatch VOD because I had a really good time playing with my buddies. And, um, and I had fun watching it. You sound annoying, but that's everyone else's problem, not yours. Hey. Own it. As long as you own it, you got the confidence for it. You used to hate your voice when you recorded yourself singing, and now you look back at your voice to improve. Exactly, yeah. And if you don't hear what other people are hearing, you can't give yourself a solid criticism, can you? You're just guessing. You got so embarrassed reading out a loud Yandere script that a friend wrote yesterday? For what? You watched it like five times? That's awesome. I thought, uh, I thought it was really fun. I thought it was a really fun stream. Learning French when you have a southern twang with curtain words is not easy. What the hell's a curtain word? Never heard of that. Now what the hell are you talking about when you mention that? Well, the southern drawl. What the hell's a goddamn curtain word? I gotta Google that. One second. One second. Let me see what the hell that is. Curtain word. What is a curtain word? I don't know what it means. It, it keeps pulling up curtains. Oh, they, they meant certain. Oh, my deduction abilities are lacking, clearly. The sweet dulcet sounds of headshots. Yo, tink, tink, tink. It's nice. You used to think you were ugly because you have a deep female voice, but times have changed since the 90s. And now you love your voice. There's a thing for everybody. All you have to do is make sure you love yourself. That's the most important thing is making sure that you can love yourself. You're dyslexic, Cap? No, it's okay. I, I just, uh, I don't want to assume that you're stupid. And I don't think you're stupid, by the way. The way I said that phrase, it, I phrase it so poorly there. I don't assume anyone's, uh, like, typing incorrectly in chat. I just take your word for it. <laughs> the headshot things give you serotonin. They do. They give me serotonin, too. Listening to my head headshots on McCree. Ding, 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 ding. Ding, 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 ding. So good. That was, that was a delusion there, thinking that I can get that many headshots in a row, but maybe on a tank, whatever. Anyway, that's besides the point. You would blush when you listen to yourself speak and you hear it recorded because they sound so different to you. Yeah, um, it has something to do with the, like the vibrations of your voice traveling from your mouth, like traveling from inside your mouth to your ears or something like that. I don't know. I forget what it is, but, um, yeah. Hearing your own recordings is the, uh, is the real you. The shadow version of you. I did so good on the stream. Thank you. I'm a pretty good Overwatch player. Every time you listen to your own recordings, it sounds like you're 10 years younger and you have no idea why. 
Um, it well, depends on what kind of recordings you're doing. If you record in front of something, are you nervous? If you're nervous when you're recording something, you might accidentally change the way you speak. Um, I don't know how to make, I don't know how to give you more confidence other than saying get more confident, lol. But, um, growing comfortable to talk in front of a mic is a skill for sure. You had to watch each POV like three times. You play Overwatch daily, so um, basically you're extra hyped to watch. I know, I saw your comments too. I'm glad you were uh, super excited about it. My ass is sore, but the puppy's on my lap. I'm definitely like slouching a little bit backwards. I'm getting a little too comfy. You gotta go. Take care. Try to listen to your covers over and over and die a inside a little. Aww. I mean... With time comes comes skill, and with skill comes confidence, and with confidence is more skill. It's a, it's that positive feedback loop. The the more confident you are, the more skilled you'll be, and the more skilled you are, the more confident you'll be. It just uh just takes time. The sacrifices I must make for pup. Yeah, my ass is going numb, but he's asleep. And how can I say no to this little guy? You liked my part in Crossing Faiths? Keep streaming that- you keep streaming that banger of a song? Thank you! Faith guides my way! I just want to call your name to heal this pain There's nothing left This is who I am! I like that song too. But I haven't listened to it in a while, actually, now that I think about it. There's no time, there's, there's no time to think I'm doing what I feel is right Take back what is mine Song's good By the way, that line, um, changes at its wake, there's more at stake uh, I specifically wrote that because I thought it had good pirate, um, imagery You know, the wake of a tide and stuff like that, changes at its wake there's more at stake. It just sounds so good. <laughs> you sing bad, but your old lady dog loves your singing anyways. Good. Sing for your dog then. Sing for your dog. If your dog loves it, that's perfect. Perfect practice too. You have an audience already. Singer, songwriter, watch out Taylor Swift. Maybe, maybe I will be one. Maybe I will be a singer, songwriter. Maybe I'll start today. There's more at stake. There's more at Steakhouse. <laughs> There's no time to eat. Butter my biscuits upright. Take that bread for mine. You just need to nom on all these soft buns. Gobble them up, drink your water, don't want to get parched. You know it's a buffet out right now. All you need is money. Is Pup a picky eater as captain? Nope, not at all. Pup will eat literally shit. <laughs> Pup will literally eat his own shit. What's the song that I've been listening to on repeat recently? Um, I haven't listened to music recently, actually. I really haven't. There's, there has, there was one song that I listened to recently, but I can't remember the name of it. It was on YouTube. That was good. Don't be mean. No, I'm not being mean. He literally eats shit. Like, I'm going to wash my hands after this because he was licking my hands earlier. You're a horrible singer, but everyone becomes a professional singer in the shower. Exactly, yeah. Also, singing in the shower is good for your throat. It's good for your vocal cords. The steamy air keeps you lubricated. Um, I forget the name of the song. Yeah, I can't remember the name of the song. Sorry, guys. It was um, it was some, some really like funky song though. You'd love some original Avalon duet songs. Oof, man, if we could do that. You know, there's a, there's a, there's a, there's a, there's a universe where that does happen. 
There's absolutely a universe where that happens. Who would I like to do it with first? I need someone who can carry my ass. So maybe, um, either, um, I think me and Zanny would have really good synergy. I think Cass and Lucy would balance me out because they can hit the notes that I can't hit. And Roscoe and I could um, definitely kill it because I know he's good at rap. There's a world where I couldn't do it with all of them. Can you suggest a singing group for us to check out if I want some Irish culture? Uh, I can't guarantee that I'll look into it. I don't do um, song recommendations very well just because I'm such a prude. You're more than welcome to, though. But yeah, I, I can't guarantee that I'll actually look into them. I'm very, uh, I'm very untrustworthy when it comes to taking song recommendations. I usually like exploring on my own. Cap is the beta of singers on God. You mean the most fleshed out? Yeah, I know. I'm the most well-rounded. For sure. I'm like the Mario of singers. How long can I continue to talking or singing before my throat starts getting tired? So when we recorded Crossing Fates, when I was in the recording booth, my session took the longest because again, um, out of everybody in Avalum, I am the least skilled at singing. So a lot of my parts um, had to be redone over and over again because I couldn't get the, um, the vision right for it. And I was in my recording booth for about two hours. And when I got out of it, I was fine. I was drinking water and I was singing. I was perfectly fine after two hours of singing. Uh, as far as talking goes, I mean, you guys, I mean, not everyone has seen it, but my Risk of Rain 2 stream lasted 12 and a half hours. And I would have kept going if it wasn't late at night. Like, I'm serious, I would have kept going. But for some reason, when I read voice lines on A Date With Death, my I get really winded. It's, just, it's, so, it's such a weird phenomenon. All my endurance, all my skill points went to endurance. Shit. I need some intelligence back. I need to at reallocate sometime. That Risk of Rain 2 stream. I endured. I freaking endured, dude. I fucking endured. I realized I haven't um, done a lot of endurance streams recently, though. I've been playing it pretty safe. Um, except, you know, <laughs> man, I just realized we're almost at four hours now. Lamau! Buy a reskill scroll. <laughs> if only they were that cheap. Okay, I think I should I should definitely end it near. For real, for real this time. I, um, I love you guys. Hope you guys take care. I'm going to go ahead and go to the ending screen. Um, after me, later today, who else is streaming? Let's see. Whatever, play one hand of clapping. Um, I'll consider it. Oh, Cass is going live in four minutes, guys. Perfect timing. Yo, I held out. I held out for uh, Cass to go live soon. Perfect. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and uh, redirect you guys over there. Okay. But I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. Get some good food in you. Where is his stream? He's playing Kukiomi. Where's his stream? Oh, there it is. It didn't have it in the title. I couldn't see it. Lamal. But, um, yeah. Take care, everybody. Get some food in you. Have a good day. It was a pleasure to keep you all here. Um, and waste your time. Hope you guys had some... Hope you guys had some good company for the stream. And I'll, I'll see you tomorrow for more Stardew Valley. Have a good day. Bye. Guys, there's no post credits. Stop, stop waiting for the post credits. It's not happening. Like, I'm so serious. It's not happening. Where Thanos? He doesn't show up. This isn't the Infinity Wars.
Guys, it's not happening. There's no post credits. Leave. Go. Get out of the theater. The show's over. The show's over, guys. Okay, bye!